Hi guys, what is going on? How are we doing? How is everybody doing? Welcome into another stream from the old Ham Sambro fella. Hope everybody is doing well. For anyone who didn't see the tweet, I am very, very excited to play some boyfriend dungeon today. All right, I had a little, oh, I had a little meltdown. Right, not a meltdown, but I was like, listen, I need something to play on stream. I'm struggling. Had a bit of a bad game in DBD last night, got fed up with it. I like DBD, I don't like playing it on my own, and I don't want to, you know, hang out with my friends because they have lives of their own and stuff as well. So if they're not playing, I don't really enjoy it on my own. It's fun, but I can't play it for too long, which obviously would make for a very short stream. So I was saying, listen, I need recommendations of something to stream. And then one of the lads recommended Boyfriend Dungeon, all right? I had never heard about it, and I was really intrigued. Um, because I looked it up on Steam, I got it on Game Pass, but I looked at the screenshots on Steam and it looks hilarious. He was telling me it's, I, I don't really know what it's about, so bear with me when I say this, but it seems to be some form of dungeon crawler, but also dating simulator where the people are weapons. And yeah, I don't really get it, like you, you can go out with some guy who's a sword or something kind of thing. I have no idea the premise, I haven't touched it. Hello Lou, welcome in, hello, oh new emotes, yes, they're up and running, okay, great stuff. The new emotes, we have four altogether. I believe three are up and running, one is still under review, which takes seven to 14 days. I don't know why it's pending approval, but hopefully when that passes, it'll be done. I don't know if it's gonna be over 14 days or not, so look, bear with us, but once it's, once it's up and running, I'll uh, of course let you know. But yeah, that's the raid icon, that's me and Danny DeVito. There's also the sandwich and the chicken, as you know. There's also a new viewer award. You can now summon Danny DeVito, which is exactly what it sounds like. I made it cheap enough, it's only a grand. So uh, yeah, listen, that's that's for you guys. But anyway, yeah, Boyfriend Dungeon. I don't really know what to expect, to be honest. I'm really excited to play it. Um, and I literally haven't touched it. I opened it up to do up the settings and just make sure everything was running okay with OBS and that kind of thing. But I don't actually know anything about what's going to happen with the story or the gameplay or anything. So um, I don't know if you guys are as excited as I am, but let's just get into it. Like, let's just, let's just see how we go. Right, we'll lower down the old tunes. Yeah, I'm really excited. So this, even the main menu is... Uh, listen to that, like... Look at this, you know, are, are these the people you can date? They're all holding weapons, I know you can date weapons. Anyway, look. Let's see, here we go, new game. This game's story involves exposure to unwanted advances, stalking, other forms of emotional manipulation. Play with care and take breaks as needed. Oh wow, serious. Oh cool, you can create, oh look at this. I'm feeling this. Name your character, well obviously, Cody. All right, pronouns, we go he, him. That's the pronouns I go by. Eye is round, round eye, heavy eye, sleepy eye, smiling eye, tough eye. I like heavy. Yeah, that's 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 like me, you know, heavy eye. Sounds a bit rapey. What kind of game is this? I'm so glad you asked because I don't have a clue, but I'm very excited. It's, it's I don't know, it's, it's, it's a dating simulator dungeon crawler like it just it, it sounded hilarious it was recommended to me by a friend i'm just gonna give it a bash but i'm actually really excited to, to play it see how we get on hairstyle spiky oh a little twirl look at that oh short is looking nice short is looking that's i like short so far that's in the lead punk's nice as well but i think short maybe yeah all right we're going with short can i change my clothes you can alter your appearance anytime in the apartment okay so this is me here we go Let's do it. Are you ready? You can change your character. Yes, I'm ready. I am so ready for this. This game sometimes sends you support of text from a, a character named the mom. Is that okay? If you answer no, we'll say with miss. That's actually really cool. Um, I'm okay with that, so I'm gonna go with yes. But like, I, I've, I've often seen, uh, you know, people playing Animal Crossing and stuff, uh, because in Animal Crossing you get letters from your mom, and you know, some people get upset if the, you know their mom has passed away or whatever. So that's pretty cool. I like that they uh, give you the option to opt out with stuff like that. Find a boarding call for Veranda Beach. All passengers, please board immediately. Sure thing. Did you get your hair cut? No, I did not get my hair cut. <laughs> this is my hair. I'm letting it grow, so I won't be getting a cut for a while. This is already adorable. Oh, wow, well, look at all these eligible suitors on the beach. Romance, here I come. The taxi's adorable. Can I just explore all this, like? 
It looks like you did. Thanks, I suppose. I wanna don't wanna fiddle with the beehive, but you know. Thank you. Okay, where are we going? Hey, welcome to Verona Beach, cuz. It's me, Jesse. <laughs> Cousin Jesse. All right, all right. I'm, I'm, I'm for it. Years, huh? Your mom said you'd grown up, but I had no idea. You're so much taller. Uh, well, I don't want to say you're hitting on me because he's my cousin, and that's kind of weird. I know very well he's Jesse, so thanks, I suppose. I am 6'5", so it's, it's already very relatable. Sorry, I'm so immersed. I just remember you as a little kid. <laughs> cousin problems. I was in college, and you were like in the fifth grade or something. Back before California. Doesn't matter. Come on. I'll show you your room for the summer. Okay, Jesse. I already like this guy. I can stay here till my lease runs out in September. I moved out to live with my partner last month to so get free rent. I don't know where the voice acting's gone. So oh, I'm going to solve your problem. What problem? Oh, I've never gone on a date. Okay, so Jesse's going to help me with my summer of love. That's okay. You know, yeah, he looks, he's, he's pretty. I'll take his, <laughs> take his guidance. Totally platonic friendly hangouts. That was a good tip. No, Jesse, we're here to bang. Okay. Bang weapons, apparently. Not a pickup artist, but I can sure teach you something about meeting people. As long as you're willing to be a little adventurous, you've come to the right place. Time for lovers, keep your eyes and mind open, and I won't guarantee you'll fall in love, but a date shouldn't be too hard to arrange. Look, I'm already flying. You know what I mean? What do you think your main love problem is? Hmm. I'm ugly, I'm cursed, and nobody appreciates me. Nobody appreciates my brilliance. I'm too pretty. That's the kind of thing a jerk would say, just so you know. Jesus, I already, already catching strays. Jesse calling me out. First step in those, find someone of similar interest in uh -huh. talking to them. So let's get you some confidence. New fitness fad, perfect for meeting people. You have an open mind. Yeah, I'm ready, Jesse. You lay it on me. It's dungeons. Dungeons is the new fad to meet people. Uh... Not sex dungeons. I oh, won't be playing this then. <laughs> Parallels, never mind. <laughs> okay, so it's not it's not all it's not all gone. God has arrived. Hello, Chris. Welcome to the chat. Everybody give a round of applause for my new mod. Anybody gives any hassle, you're going to be dealing with Chris. Chris is in charge of corralling you guys. You know, don't just from like video games, a D&D like that, but in real life. Okay. Monster infestations. When people kill them for money. Is that a good place to meet people? Okay. Building confidence, getting a workout, and... Uh, can you turn into a weapon? I can try. No, wait, can you, Jesse? Nah. No, okay. <laughs> Thanks, Jesse. You squeeze your eyes and turn into a... <laughs> No. My hands are still the same. Aww. Same of me. Don't look so sad, cuz. You can't do it. Okay, so neither of us can turn into weapons. Doesn't run the family. Transforming's big in Verona Beach. People like us are called wielders around the weapon, folks. Okay, so I, I assume me as a wielder has to meet up with a weapon to wield. Surely. Combat has some sword friend of mine. I arranged one for this afternoon. Oh, meeting someone already, a sword apparently. See, you heard it here first, folks. I have the power. Yeah. Yeah. You you, you tell him, Chris. Jesse's eyes widen and he shakes his head. Uh... It's not a date, it's a lesson. Wheeling isn't romantic, perfectly platonic. Important thing is you're stronger together. Okay. Go out there and get to the mall. Why the mall? Hmm. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to meet Isaac, who's a fencing teacher and a perfect professional. Okay, so he's going to set me up on a proper date and he will text me the info. Jesse goes to leave, then pauses. Forgot to give you a little tour of the apartment, but this is sort of all there is. It's all yours. Have ideas on how you could use the shelves and desks, but we can talk with that after you've settled in. Feel free to use the mirror anytime when I try some new looks. No pressure. See you, cuz. Jesse leaves. All right, so this is the, this is the, this is the digs. Oh, okay, so I have a phone from Jesse, a call from Jesse. Or a text from Jesse, Jesus. Don't forget to meet Isaac at the mall. Also, I just saw it on the news that there's a weapon thief out there. Weapon people are going missing. Stay safe. Namaste. Okay, right, thank you, Jesse. But I'll click it out my phone. Inventory, weapon, info, gifts, anything? No. Inventory? None. Okay. Oh, dragons galore, fireball. All right, a weapon info. Right. Can't, can't craft, can't do zines, can leave. Mirror, let's see what threads we got. Ooh. Oh my god, I'm fabulous. 
Wow. This game is so progressive. I'm gonna rock with this. Because it's similar to what I had on, but you know, just with a little more pizzazz. I hope if shoes on, they look like socks. Oh, hats. Oh, wow. <laughs> this is gas. This looks like something that a dungeon crawler would wear, but I feel like it's not aimed at a dungeon crawler. It's, you know, there's a turban. This is looking good, Habib. So let's. I will keep the hair visible. All right. Yeah, feeling good about this. Later, apartment. Oh, wow. This is real nice. There's my gaff. I could just go home. I don't want to do that. Ah, oh, red stripes for fire. Listen, what's done is done. Be careful, it's dangerous. Okay, so this is where I gotta go, isn't it? Yeah, you gotta go to the mall. And we're in. Let's go find a date. Or something. Dungeon Fair unidentified. This game is fucking mad. <laughs> what am I doing? I can't go up there. Like, is this under siege? Like, or is there supposed to be, like, people walking around? Like, is it, I don't think it's safe to be in here. I assume it's closed for whatever reason. Here's a sword. Long, thin blade. The hilt fits nicely into your grip. A man's voice vibrates in the metal and up to your hand, making you... Uh, you must be Jesse's friend. Hi, I'm Isaac. Isaac. Oh, this is Isaac. All right, so yeah, he's a sword. Isaac the sword. Um, I'm that spit on the nose. I'm not gonna acknowledge that he's a sword. I'll just be accepting. Pleasure to meet you, Isaac. Enchanté. The pleasure is Enchanté. Mine, <laughs> I you. But I'm indeed in a stock at times. Forgive me for remaining in this form for now. He sounds handsome when he's not in his sword it takes form. Takes some effort to change shape, and I'd rather focus on the lesson at hand. I can respect the hustle. Your hand on my hilt is as good a handshake as any, after all. Be on the nose, but we'll roll with it. Now, if you take a look around, you'll see we're in a mall. His voice is like boar. I'm already falling for him. A place you can confront your A dunge. Oh, I like that. It's a nice little colloquialism. It's the sweet dunge, brah. I like Here, that. Your own psychology will create monsters to fight. I okay. chose the mall because most people have fears that easily manifest here. Such as? It depends on the person. Strangers, inadequacy, sterility, poverty. Jeez. Everyone's afraid of. Let's go ahead and look around. Let's see if we can find any monsters to fight. Okay, dude, let's get it. It's me and my boy Isaac. So light attack, heavy attack, dodge. Oh, the dodge is so cute. A few attacks in a row. Let's do a combo. Try light attack, light attack, then heavy attack fast. Oh, that was sick. Oh. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Enough practice. Be meaning to give this a go. Game a go. Looks lovely and weird. It's really... I, I'm so excited to play it. I was just recommended by one of the lads, and I'm already loving it just because it, it looks hilarious. Oh, God. Oh, it's a phone. All right. All right, Isaacs. Ah, oh, he's not serenading me with his voice anymore. You're not bad either. Okay. Um. Oh, I know. My farm is rough. Eh... Uh, eh, thanks. Yeah, no, no, I don't like that. You know, Isaac, you gotta, you gotta put me up a bit more. Let's talk about that monster. I came from inside my mind. When I first started going into the dungeon as a wielder, I thought, okay, so he was a wielder and now he's a weapon person. Can you be both or do wielders become weapon people? Is that my destiny? I fought a lot of trucks. What do you mean trucks? Yeah, trucks. Strange. They don't even hate trucks and yet they manifested. They're monsters, pickup trucks, dumb trucks, even cement grinders. It's because I had some issues around masculinity and boyhood, preferably from my father. Eventually I worked through that and killed a boss monster truck. I felt good. Points out your phone monster can mean a few things. Maybe you fear connections to other people and intimacy. Maybe you fear helpless. Crawl like a worm. Like the way I did. We'll figure it out deeper. The, the, we'll figure it out the deep we explore into the dungeon. What if we die? We'll just go as deep as we can. If we get too tired and collapse, that's okay. We'll still get to keep any treasure we find. Mm. Okay. Beverages, tea, coffee, that sort of thing, they keep you going. You can hold up to three at a time and use them when you need them. One last observation, you can use the power of the Zines in combat. Press the Zine button. And use your Dragon Zine and breathe fire. What the fuck is this game? <laughs> Maybe you can find a new Zine or even make your own. I assume it's what the crafting is in the apartment. Be sure not to always rely on them though, as their use is limited. Right. 
Be brave, fight best we can, together we can become anything. Thanks Isaac, pure hype man. Okay, so Q is my uh, gas. And then F is to have a sup of coffee, which I can't do because I have full health. Oh, sugar. All right, that's fine. Can I check my, can I use sugar? Okay, no, it's just there. All right, can I destroy these boys? Can I fall down them? Can I jump them? Okay, no. They look like holes in the floor, but they could also just be pillars. Right, bring it on. Me and I is great to take on the world. Ah, oh, jeez. I regret saying that. Uh, uh, that could have gone much worse. Yeah, thanks, Isaac. Now I can drink my coffee. Oh, okay. And um, where's the map? Right, sort of way. We keep going. Hmm. What's that? This is a door, Isaac. Oh. Scandal. Oh, it's a sword. Okay. Oh, it looks like the guy from the main menu with the, the you know, the dude with the top open. The hilt is cool, almost cold to the touch, but it warms quickly under your hand. The blade begins to transform. Oh my god, be still my beating heart. Well, Sunder. Name Sunder. Whew. Hi, Sunder. Oh my god. Isaac Brooks. Pleased to make your acquaintance. Unusual to be here without a wielder, no. Oh, fight over me, gentlemen. Fight over me. Yeah. To be honest, I'm not really sure how I got here. Last thing I remember is someone in a cloak chanting. Hmm. And now I'm all dinged up. See, okay, so, so far, Isaac wins on the voice. Isaac's voice is like buttery velvet. You keep talking, you talk to me all day. But I don't know what Isaac looks like, and Sunder is is getting me fairly hot under the collar now, so let's let's see how we go. I must have made someone really angry if they abducted me and chipped me, whoever they are. But my luck is turning around because here you are. Ooh. I didn't think anyone like you would be in the dungeon. Little old me. Yeah, you. I'm not talking to the monsters, that's for sure. There were other options. Ooh. <laughs> Sunder and Samsung. What are those emotes? <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, if you're into it. Maybe we can go on a date later. Would that be okay? Yeah. Maybe together we can figure <laughs> out how I got This guy doesn't wait around. I like that. I like, go get it. Go get it, King. Maybe together we can figure out how I got I mean, down here. You would leave me here and not keep me in their embrace forever, right? Oh. I need to play a kill. Uh, are you hurt? I'm just gonna oh, swing right by that. But my pride more than anything. I'm sure Isaac can explain. Now I'll just cut my way out of here while you two finish up your run. So can they, like, move around while they're in weapon mode? Like. Okay, the damage blade saunters away. Okay, hilarious. <laughs> he was knocked out, damaged, and imprisoned here. Weapon forms heal quickly, as they are made from our spirits more than our bodies. Okay. Still, this is serious. I'll report our findings to the authorities. I hope the abductor can be caught. Smart move, Isaac. Let's keep our eye out for any other victims as we explore the dunge. Oh my god, oh my god, ah, ah, oh my god, what the- <laughs> What just happened? <laughs> I just got battered by a lot of phones. Is that supposed to happen? Was I just sleeping? Nah, surely I'm doomed to just be punched around. Jesus, this is serious. You feel the paramedics gently bring you to the surface and back to consciousness. Oh, I wonder is that like- a symbolic surface, like was I about to die, or they just physically mean the surface for like out from the dungeon? I assume it's a juxtaposition of both. You're bone tired, but otherwise unharmed. You realize you're still holding a sword. Ooh, Isaac, would you like to come in? And that concludes our first lesson. Would you mind releasing me? Do I have to? Boyfriend dungeon, you up till? Afraid so. This is it. Until our next lesson, anyhow. All right. The blade begins. Oh, here we go. We're gonna get to see him. Oh, so suave and debonair. 
Oh, the glass of wine. Oh, I'm so torn. I don't know which one I prefer. Oh, Sean, hey. Oh, look at his little brooch. That's not like that. It was a pleasure to train with you. Thank you. But I must get back to work. If I may say, your fencing style is rough, but has unusual The wine, Gizda. Give me the wine. Get me all wine and dine, Isaac. If you're interested in refining your form, come by my office. I have the gear necessary for lessons. We sure. still have no leads on finding the source of your insecurities that form these monsters. I'm clearly afraid of technology in some form. They're all TVs and phones. So feel free to call upon me in the future. Or screens. When you need a dungeon delving partner. Will do, Isaac. Until next time, then. Ta-ta. His lessons. Oh. Oh. Oh, he's already texting me, look. He's typing. I'll provide equipment at my office, Brooks Associates, if you wish. Sincerely, Isaac. It's not a letter. Um, do I have to... Okay, I don't want to train right now, but I will text them back. Mom. Oh, God. I already miss you. If you're on a beach, big city, it could be dangerous. Always listen to Jesse. Watch out for pickpockets, and are you okay? Did you find the apartment? I'm fine, Mom. You don't need to worry. What well, she's typing. I've just been in this place before. Oh, that's cold. I love you, sweetie. Imagine I could just duck her with a smiley face. Nah, I love my mom. Yeah, I will. Okay. Um, Isaac. Jesse, did you make it to the dungeon? Report in, soldier. You didn't tell me he was hot. <laughs> you fucking didn't. Yet somehow you figured it out on your own. All right. Okay, no problem, Jesse. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Oh, he's coming over now. Oh, Jesus, okay. Hey, cuz. I heard you, uh, picked up Isaac. And he says you're a natural. Found another sword, too. Whoa, two swords in one day. What are the odds? Don't fight for me. Mud wrestle for me. Anyway, I'm glad it worked out. Well, I, I wish they'd keep the voice acting the whole way. It's, I don't know, it's just nice, like... Isaac says you might be afraid of technology. Oh, look at that. Oh, always on, you know what I mean? Down there for dancing, not just a hat rack, lads. Either way, I trust you'll work on it together. If you're, in, if you're not into them, it's good practice being normal alone with a handsome stranger. In case, you know, you might get nervous after all about the idea of dating. I'm not nervous. Ah, okay. I have to be nervous, apparently. Ah. Nerves are that bad, and at least you gained a bit of confidence. Well, look at you. I went to high school with a guy that runs a sword shop, and he's single. At least that's what Eric's profile says online. I haven't seen him in person in years. He might be the only guy in town who knows more about swords than Isaac, but I got his number. Jesse pokes his uh -huh. phone. Aha, there we go. He's free for coffee tomorrow. Are you in? Yeah, what's he look like? Uh -huh. Tall, thin, sharp. Oh, blonde. I'm in. It's not an elephant man situation. Besides, it's just for practice. So you'll go, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. That's the spirit. Tomorrow at 11, kicks the cabbages down the street. It's just coffee. Don't panic, lads. It's just a drink. Talk about dungeons, get to know them. Some won't last forever, and you gotta meet new people sometime. So let's role play and some practice. I'll be Eric, no pressure. Just try it out. Okay, Eric. I walk in, I enter the cafe. Here he is sitting waiting for me. Hi! Why am I so fucking nervous? <laughs> Breath catches in my throat and I start coughing. <clears throat> Maybe try it in a mirror tonight. Might more work than I thought, but that's okay. You'll do fine. Practice makes perfect, lads. A lot of, a lot of lessons to be learned in this game. See ya. Good luck tomorrow. Jesse leaves. How will I spend the evening? Go for a walk. Oh, nightclub. Yeah, go in. You notice a woman watching from the VIP section, but you're too shy to talk to her. Eventually, you head home and go to bed. You wake up paralyzed with deep, inexplicable fear. Today will be your first date for the rest of your life. What if you're not even sure what you're afraid of, but it feels like you can't breathe? Distract yourself. You play a game on your phone for a few minutes. Eventually, you feel a bit better. And I walk down to the coffee shop. Did what I sleep? Is it 11? Oh, wait, yeah, I assume I went home and went to bed. Welcome to Kicks. Mm. Man in the corner. That's me in the corner. Hey. You're Jesse's cousin, right? Oh god, he looks like a mad I'm scientist. Now tell me everything you know about swords. Do you prefer one or two-handed? 
it's that small I'm not I'm, this guy straight out the gate I'm not vibing with alright so he's gonna have to earn it it's not like Isaac or Sunder this one is he's, he's, he's down it here so we'll see he's gotta, he's gotta woo me yeah yeah hello I'm a human I eat and breathe I eat food and breathe there how about you Ugh. oh a human too how surprising blah 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 look I don't mean to be rude you're attractive obviously obviously but I run a business and I can't waste my time surely we can jump straight to the shared interest I sometimes like the speed of one handed weapons but it's a rush to use the heft of two hands Jesse said you're a dungeon crawling type so I thought I'd offer my help finding a weapon I don't like this guy out of the gate not doing well. He's not doing well. Help finding a weapon. Uh, I already found one. That turtle neck, though. Yeah. I wonder does he turn into an anvil of some sort? Found one on the street. That can't be good. Ugh. Prude. Ah. Oh. Person becomes a weapon, obviously. That's not really for me. Totally cool if you're into it. But my shop only sells pure steel. Some imported, some made on site. Maybe I give a discount to a fellow enthusiast who keep my blades a good home. Hmm. I do appreciate fine craftsmanship. He has an eye for two as a smith. I take raw, dirty hunks of metal and with finesse and strength turn them into art. I try, Angel, I'm still learning. Video tutorials can I teach you so much? Oh, God. I totally get it. Maybe someday I'll make something beautiful enough for you to wield. Yeah, I wouldn't hold your breath, Eric. Here's a gift card. Here's a gift for fellow crafts. Maybe you knew something with these. Oh, lovely wire and plastic and bracelets recipe. Imagine bringing that to a day. Imagine going like, oh yeah, I, I'm actually a smith and I brought you a gift. It's the ingredients and the method to make this. I didn't make it myself for you. Here's the bits and bobs and you got to do the work. Want to go on a proper date sometime? Maybe I need more frivolity in my life. Uh, I will think about it. Mm-hmm. Mm, that was kind of a no, Eric. But, you know. I miss Sunder. Do I get, like, do I unlock new clothes or anything? I am, I'm feeling bucket hat today. I'm going to mix it up today. Well, it's a new day, so I changed my whole outfit. So, um, red stripes and a bucket hat. What goes better with the bucket hat? Uh, yeah, I like the mini dress. Oh, it has pockets. Amazing. Yeah, this is looking nice. I'm all blue today. Okay. Um, we can craft now. Okay, I can craft a bracelet. Hilarious. Wait for a gift opportunity to give it to someone special. Can I make more? No, I need more plastic. All right. Zines. Uh, okay, I only have the one. All right. Let's check the mobile. Oh, I should really do his lesson. I think that's main quest is side quest. I'm gonna meet up with Isaac. We do that now, Isaac, or no? You did it. You went on a date, sort of. How'd it go? Yeah, shit. I didn't like him. Don't worry about it. Most of those dates aren't great. But you did it, and you still have most of the summer left. You're now infinitely more date experienced than you were yesterday. Plus, I'll find another date venture for you soon. What about Isaac? I like Isaac. He's pretty. Date Isaac too, if you want. That's no bother. But variety is the spice of everything. So I'm going to find you someone nice. Oh, message from Sunder, look. <sighs> oh, fuck off, Eric. Or Jesse, sorry. Go away. Stop texting me. You can get crafts, blah, blah, blah. blah, blah, blah. I'll let you know when your next date is set up. I'm done texting you now. I do like dancing. Yeah. I love it. Yes. Yes. Come to my club, La Rosa. I'll be there. You bet your ass I'll be there someday. <sighs> okay, cool. Me too. Well, I'd hope so. Just tell the bouncer you're with me. Sure thing, babe. Oh, he has me wrapped around his finger. I am anybody's. Right, let's go for a ramble. There's La Rosa. Oh, I'm looking all fresh in my little blue, de blue dress. What did I... I uh, where was Isaac? Oh! Close shop. Hi, clerk. What money do I have? I have a buck fifty. Okay. Oh, look at that cardigan, though. Oh, wow. Why would you like these? A bit pricey, though. I need to make some moolah.
But there's Isaac there. I'll bounce over there after this close up. Sunder fuck. Sunder better fuck. Because he's going to be splitting me in half later if he plays his cards right. Oh, opera tickets. Okay. I need to, you know, not be so destitute and get some Mulan into me. Right, obviously, Isaac. Hey, babe. You're stopped at Isaac's office by his assistant. Excuse me, do you have an appointment, Mr. Brooks? Yeah. Well, hello. Cody, you made it, Christine. Cody is always welcome here. Look at that, he's how he wants me. Yes, Mr. Brooks, right away, Mr. Brooks. It's good to see you. I was hoping you'd take up my offer. Let's begin. Do you prefer foil, saber, or ape? I don't know what the fuck ape is. Can I wield you, big boy? I can't teach while wielded. For now, take up the foil. Will you be quick enough? Bodes well for me that speed impresses you. Do you watch friends? We shall see. Now ready yourself. Don't mind the office equipment. I do this all the time. Oh, wow. Slick. Stand straight with your blade out towards my heart. Turn to regard me from the side over your shoulder and hip. This is the on guard stance. You're quite literally on guard. We will begin with the basic movement. Looking into my eyes, advance towards me. Front foot, then back foot. Step. Mm. Try lifting your toes first, don't cross the legs. Now in foil, you can only score by hitting the torso. In the saber, the upper body. But in the dungeons, you don't need to score points with any judges. I suppose that means we should use epe rules. Any hit counts. Let's try a lunge attack then. Extend your front leg with all your weight. Keep your front foot fat. Front foot flat. No bent ankle. Fucking tongue twister. You lunge heavily forward, feeling awkward. <laughs> He's laughing at me, but I have talent apparently. Hey, love rank up. Holding row lets you counterattack if used just before an incoming attack. Okay, sick. Thanks, Bay. We've reached a new level of understanding, so now you can parry with me. The more time we spend together, the better we'll be able to fight together. This means something different for each weapon, but for me, parrying is a friends only maneuver. <laughs> if somebody attacks me, I will not parry them unless I like them. I'll just let the hit land or I'll dodge. To parry in the dungeon, hold dodge just before the enemy attack hits to automatically counter. Okay, I need to remember that. You guys remember that as well. I got a whole dodge just before I, I, I attack lands. Don't even forget that. You can also check out our parry in the... Okay, in the combo details, Grant, because I was wondering would there be a way for me to check that. I would have to imprint everything from memory. He loosens his gloves and removes his jacket. <clears throat> Perhaps we should get to know each other. Should we get dinner? Oh, ducked. Ducked. Oof. My pride. My pride. You're a dashing dunge hero now, right? Well, I have been in one dungeon. Mm -hmm. And I lasted all of 10 minutes. So, I guess you could say I'm kind of a professional. What do your parents think about your dangerous profession? Do they approve? Mom always supports me. Dungeons are a family tradition, despite the fact that Jesse only told me about them yesterday. I'm glad she respects your choices. It's heartening to know that such parents exist. Does your mother adopt? Oh, so you're gonna just be pawning off a kid? Mm. I do prefer life on the straight and narrow. Oh, who was it? One minute, please. Oh, who's this? Is this Big Daddy Isaac? Papa Brooks? Shouldn't you be working? You can wait in the lobby. Just gonna keep your guest waiting while you faff about. Vincent, you're 20 minutes early for our appointment. Thought I might have some priority in the life of my only child. Pleasure to meet you, future father-in-law. I'm sure meeting me is probably the highlight of your week. Oh, he's a prick. He's a prick. We don't like him. I'm terribly sorry, Cody. Yeah, you'd want to be. He's, he's hurting your chances. I'm not going to lie to you. Text you set up an next appointment. Yeah, okay. I'm just saying that unless Sunder's day goes as bad as this, you're in second place. What's, what's next in your slumming schedule? Uh, it's the fucking 21st century old man. Texting is everything. Would you drink water from plastic bottles too? <laughs> Horrifying. Ponce. Are there any depths you won't stoop to? Oh, eavesdrop. He's been a... Low standards. This game hurts my feelings more than I thought it would. Oh, this douche. Sorry we were interrupted. You know what, Isaac? Do you care for business talk? No. I'm a bit upset with you, to be honest. And my feelings are hurt, and you need to you need to fix things. Yeah, I'm not texting. You can go away, Isaac. 
I'm really glad Jesse introduced this. Is this the equivalent of not replying? You should come by Naked Steel sometime. Our scimitars have scintillating curves. Special price for a special guy. What do you say? No thanks, Eric. I don't think this is going to work. I'll just say, pretty please, check it out before you judge. I'll be waiting and hoping. Yeah, I wouldn't hold your breath, buddy. You are quite rude to me. Mom, honey, I know you've always been afraid of change. And I'm glad you're facing your fears. I believe in you. But Jesse says you're fighting monsters. Eric, like he Eric looks like he loves a good wordle. Look, don't we all? Did we all get the wordle today, actually? I only got it there like an hour or two ago. Yesterday's one was poxy. Did we all get yesterday's one? Did everybody do the hurdle? Not the H-E-A-R, just the H-E-R-D-L-E, -E, the farm one. Yeah, I like that. Just another wordle. I'd hope to pick a less dangerous career, like cobra wrestling or wreck diving. I have health care. That's not a reason to take more risks. If something happened to you, I don't know what I'd do. Of course I'd support you, no matter what. But be safe. I will, and I relax. Just relax. Thank you. Eric is dreamy, though. Fuck Wordle, all about Hurdle. I like the both of them. I'd prefer Wordle. Eric is... Yeah, look, I don't know how I feel. He, he's nice to look at, but... I don't know, he could have treated me a bit nicer. Any new signs? No. Craft. Nothing. Is it a new day? No, it's not. I have to go see Sunder. I'm all done up. In my blue dress. Alright, here we go. Also, oh, kitty. Hmm? Name. I'm with Sunder, dude. I just realized I don't need to use my right hand. It doesn't need my mouse. That's the girl I was too afraid to speak to. Hmm. But I just can't feel a real connection, you know? She's talking about me. Mm -hmm. Join the club. I don't know. What's the point? Hey, Cody, do you believe in soulmates? Absolutely, I do. You wonder if you said something wrong. <laughs> I think I do too. I just keep getting disappointed. I'm not sure anymore. All right, I said the right thing. Sunder fucks. This guy fucks. Finishers cause enemies to bleed. They make it look so easy in the movies. Romance has been dead at least 500 years. This is Mandy, my business partner, co-owner of the club. Oh, he owns the club. Did he tell me that? Charmed, I'm sure. What kind of sword do you turn into again? Oh, uh, <laughs> little old me is just a wielder, Mandy, darling. I literally talked to you five minutes ago. Are you listening at all? Come on, Mandy. No, you're not fucking listening. This bitch. Nah. Nah. Don't dance. Sunder, pick me up, babe. Feeling here with my abduction and dunge outing. What about you? Let's get our fucking freak on, bud. We dance, we're gonna die in 50 years. Uh... Probably will. <laughs> <laughs> Lighten up, Mandy. Sunder mostly sways and sips his drink, but Mandy dances with abandon. You can feel the music thumping in your chest. Try some dance moves, mix it up. You take your chance and put your heart into every motion. Mandy takes it as an invitation to dance very, very close to you. Sunder smiles and leaves the dance floor in the direction of the bathroom. Oh no, I've squandered it with Sunder, maybe. But, you know, Mandy's still an option. She leans in, her breath warm in my ear. You should really be careful, little one. Sunder eats up lovers one by one. He seems nice, but he's double-edged. I know you said you're looking for a mate, so believe me, Sunder isn't it. He lies, and he's dangerous. Sunder's using you. Part of it is his addiction, but he's too selfish and violent to be a good boyfriend. Why are you his friend? I'd rather be with you. Oh, do I take the shot? Why are you his friend? I can be friends with assholes, I just don't date them. But I like you. You're sweet. I'm just trying to help. Be careful. Anyway, I'm gonna go. Good luck. Mandy kisses you on the cheek and leaves. Crowd parts on a sword that seems to be dancing its way towards you. Mandy left, huh? So it's just us two now. Let's enjoy this moment while we can. I prefer a human form, yeah. As you wish. Better? Oh. You dance together late into the night until you're breathless and sweaty. Eventually the night is over and you head home. Alone? Alone. Jesse. Okay, nothing from Jesse. Well. Hey cutie, sorry if I'm too flirty. You can tell me to back off, but this is how I am. You're a good dancer. Mm. 
I'm I see I look right we we just met Mandy. I want to I want to explore Sunder, right? I want to see how he goes. Keep my options open with Mandy if I can. I don't know cuz boyfriend dungeon I didn't I just assumed it was all going to be men. But yeah, see I don't know if I want to play my cards too soon. I might just let him continue on the way he's doing. Keep him going nice and flirty with me, but I'll keep what Mandy said in the back of my mind. I'm going to keep options open with Isaac. Um I'm not really vibing with Eric to be honest. I'll see what his text says. Let's go again sometime. Sure, Sunder. Bring Mandy. Bring all the eligible suitors. Uh, Eric. It's crazy Jesse has a cousin like you. He's a loser, or was, in high school. No offense. Absolutely fuck right off. You are the loser. Don't you dare talk about Jesse that way. Oh, this fella's a prick. No. Oh, I hate him. Oh, I hate him. Oh, what a bastard. Explore Sunday. I will explore. So I'm going to feel him out. Eric can absolutely jump off a bridge. Jesse says you went on a date. They better have treated you well. You only deserve the best, you know. Thanks, man. Appreciate that. Sorry, sorry. Let's do it. Don't be apologizing. I know you will. Okay. <laughs> the fucking knife emotes. Oh, my God. That emo is the fucking image of Eric. <laughs> oh, my God. <gasps> yeah, no, he's uh, he's he's firmly out of the running at the moment. Um, is it a new day? Yeah, it is a new day. So I need to change my clothes. Uh, I'm going to go with the Habib thing today. And... Oh, yeah, that's nice. I'm feeling that. I'm feeling that. Good morning, world, and all who inhabit it. Straight to the dunge. Oh, who can I bring? Isaac or Sunder? Um, I haven't used Sunder, so I could give him a shot. He must feel the wrath. All right, what are the what are the attacks? I wish we could go shopping. Okay. I'm trying to get some money in my pocket. Oh shit! Wasn't watching. iPhones. Ah. Technology. Oh, oh, here we go. Bank, bank. I got a crit. I right, fold them in, fold them in, fold them in. Funnel, funnel, funnel. Beh, whoop. Oh, I got achievement. Kill five enemies in a second or less. There's now another time to be reading shit. <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh my god. It's actually really fucking difficult. <sighs> These fucking turret TVs. There's so much health as well. <sighs> my god. <laughs> fucking die. Right, one down. I need some more coffee. Oh, I can fucking hit the... Oh, I can hit them. Ow, 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 ow. Sonder, I'm okay. Ah, ah, Jesus. This is ridiculously intense for what I thought this fucking game was going to be. Ah, my God. I need some coffee. It's under help. Oh, no. Help. I need to isolate them. Oh, my God. Ah, you fucking dick. Do I look okay, Sunder? Do I? This is really fucking tough. He was, oh, I forgot all about Q. Oops. Elder Ring Beast. Elder Beast is nothing on these. Yeah, fuck me. I forgot all about my sign. And we remember. Oh, you up. Oh. <laughs> Maybe. Heh. <laughs> I was feeling extra sharp today. Oh, pigs or it didn't happen. <laughs> it's like on the bed. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, no, I'm not going to play it too. I'm going to keep my cards somewhat close to my chest. 
I want to say I'm blushing, but it's more than that. Maybe I'll show you more sometime. See you in the dunge. He's coming on strong. I might give Isaac a call tomorrow and I go dungeon delve him. Jesse said you're fighting your inner demons in the dunge, so it's kind of like therapy, but with swords. Yeah. No. That sounds right. Sounds it's, it's good. It sounds healthier than I thought. At least if you don't take any permanent damage, therapy, therapy is important when you're feeling on edge. I never told you this, but I went therapy for 12 years. It helped me grow and level up as a person. I'll try to do the same. That's my boy. Love you, ma. Right. Straight back in. Did I get any money? Oh, I got a uh, dollar and 48 cents. Don't like to brag, uh, Isaac. Just Isaac? Yeah, Eric can absolutely jump off a fucking bridge. How dare he just bitch about Jesse like that? Jesse's been nothing but nice to me. He put me up in an apartment. I'm starting to think Introduce me to you for fuck's sake. For you. Eh. Yeah. Money. Three ten oh eighty eight cent. Okay. Uh was there anything over here? Whoop, boosh. Oh, I didn't, didn't know if I got anything there. Oh, my health has gone up. Oh, I leveled up. Okay, sweet. So two extra HP now. Oh my god. Oh my god. Get this. Just keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. Fuck you. Alright, nearly there, nearly there. Hit me, hit me, hit me. Go on. Yup. I just need my boy Isaac. Just quick sup of coffee into me. Get the HP up. Oh, new level. Yeah, I'll take you with me, Isaac. Keep Bay with me. Got me this far. Oh no. Oof. Need to get the fucking TVs out of the way first. Alright. Ah, oh, this is cheesy. <laughs> Fuck you, phones. <laughs> you must. <laughs> oh, some uh, wire and some plastic. That's a new bracelet. I'll give that to Isaac. Or Sunder or Mandy, you know, whoever. Whoever takes my fancy. I really like in my hood. This is why I'm doing. Ooh! Hilt is wrapped in several layers of leather and the double edge blade is chipped. Doesn't look great. What the hell? What the hell? You not just like. Grab me without warning. I know tradition is all choose your weapon, but consent is important. Ooh, sorry, I, I didn't know. Sorry, I didn't mean to snap. I just am not sure what's going on. I was out at night as you do, and then new weapon indeed. Bam! I'm here. My blade hurts. Monsters everywhere. I'm Valeria. Nice to meet you. Sort of. Are you also a person, surely? Yep, naturally. Not sure how else a dagger would talk, but you do you. All right, just be fucking polite, Emily. Normally, I'd switch to human form around now, to be polite. Yeah, try it sometime. But I don't know you. I'm still recovering from whatever just happened. I'd rather play it safe. I can, I can, I can respect that. And I'm certainly not going to put myself in a stranger's hands and let you use me. Yeah, that's fair enough. Uh, I, I can get take it. care of myself, mostly. I could use some extra cash, though, so I'll keep in touch. 
Ciao for now. I'd really like to see this weapon in person before I use it. It's like, what if it's flat? No, I don't want it. I don't want that. What's that? Is it boss fire or something? Oh god. Ow. That was a challenge room. That was way easier than the, the regular room I had to go through to get here. <laughs> this floor is big. I need to um, explore everything. Oh, okay. I just wanna, that's the way I have to go, so I'm just gonna go this way really quick and make sure I'm not missing it. Oh, there's enemigos in. Oh, God. Mucho de enemigos. This floor is huge. I'll go up there in a sec. The, is this, this way I came, wasn't it? Yeah, this way I came. So. Let's see what's up over here, because there's like a row or something. It's alright to let your guard down now. Oh, what's this? Hmm. Oh, baby. Some chocolate ice cream. Hmm. Yeah, drop it on them. <laughs> The piazza, piazza, piazza. Oh, I can't fucking. I'm butchering the language. Have you ever been to Italy? They have fantastic fencers in Rome. Top notch. Perhaps you can go to a match together someday. Sounds good to me, babe. Would you like to? Oh, yeah. This is yours, chicken. Oh god, did not like it. Oh my god, I just got ducked. Oh no. Oh, that hurt. That hurt. That fell. I feel I'm very embarrassed. He just left me hanging. Some fierce. Wreck the shop. Oh, help. Full of coffees. Oh, that's, and this is that to put me in the mood for a coffee now. I'm gonna make one when I get off stream. It's gonna be lovely. That looks so painful. Just booting a big fucking safe with your foot. Who? The jury's still out as if I have shoes on. Sag. Check out your workman. Okay, so now we're back up to the big scary room. We got full health and a Zion, so. Oh, oh. Is that new? Sick. Alright, here we go, guys. Let's get it, boys. Fuck up, fuck up. Eh. Keep moving, keep moving. Quick like cat, quick like cat. Float like a butterfly snake on a beat. Eh. Keep going, keep going. Quick like cat, quick like cat, quick like cat. I want to fucking try the parry thing. Ah, cool. Die, bitch. Ah. Oh, see that? TVs. <laughs> fucking. <laughs> um, right, I'm going to have a sup of coffee and then refill them. Jesus Christ, you don't get a lot of money. I'm gonna be ages saving up for them opera tickets. Some here. Um, okay. And. The box. Did we. I'm just. I think we did everywhere. I'm just gonna go back and check the entrance to this part, just in case we forgot anything. I don't wanna leave any. Oh, the text. Valeria, wanna meet up sometime? Sure. All right. Neither of us are going to commit to sending a time and place, it seems. Um, I think... Yeah, okay, that's the map maxed out. Oh, I can see the whole map. Ah, oh, this is handy. So I'm just going to the top. The save you missed, I think. Uh, did I not get that? Uh, I think I got it. And it looked really fucking painful when I booted it with my may or may not be wearing shoes foot. I can't remember what I got from it though. 
Oh, it was just a lot of bits and bobs. Oh, and then... Um, oh, no, yeah, it was just bits and bobs. Weapon info. E-stock. Heavy, heavy, light. Heavy, light, heavy. Oh, God. The, the, Jesus. The icons are throwing me. Light, light, light. Light, light, heavy. Light, heavy, heavy. Heavy, heavy, heavy. Light, light, heavy. Light, heavy, heavy. Light, light, light. Heavy, heavy, heavy. Some moolah. Dill, I just want to give you a little thank you for recommending this because I'm actually having a weirdly fun time with it. I'm loving how, like, fucking weird it is. <laughs> it's just so quirky or something. Such a weird spin on stuff. Oh, flying videotapes. Bitch. Um, how are we looking with the map? Okay, we'll go down because there's definitely enemies here. Whoop. Ah, I see help. Yup, Binsky. Oh, warrior. Whopper. Bracelets all over the I can't wait to make more bracelets for people to turn me down and make feel shit for giving gifts. It sneaks up on you. Fucking does. I'm really liking it though. <laughs> it's weird, like. Ow. Bollocks. <laughs> Bollocks is right. I have no signs. Shoe grit. Oh, oh, what's this? Glass. Cool. Just a pure sphere of glass by the looks of it. Oh, ka-ching. Rob the blank. Trash. Is this done? Oh. Vending machine offers several choices. Fucking three euro. For... I only have $16. He went from drat to bollocks. <laughs> Smashing up the place just like Ezra Miller. <laughs> oh, my God. What is he at? Ah. Like, he's just, he's like, I'm fed up of being famous. I want to nuke my career. I'm going to buy the Fiverr thing. This is. Oh, wow. This game. Why am I hear more about this game? It's like a weird spin. Like, you hear a lot about, um, you know, like, Moonlighter and stuff like that. Or uh, Dead Cell. Obviously, Dead Cell is, like, an extreme example because it's really fucking popular. Or Binding of Isaac or whatever. Oh, I get it, Isaac. But, um... This is fucking... This seems to have loads to it, like. I just never really heard anything about it. Arrested again the other day. What is he doing? Like, what's he actually doing? He has some... Uh, troubles by the looks of it. Mm -mm. Oh, I couldn't possibly. I don't know anything about these kinds of games. I wasn't allowed near them as a child. And these mm -hmm. days, I don't have the time. I'll watch you, though. They look quite exciting. Oh, Dog Walker! I have my dog beside me here on the bed. I'm currently holding her paw. So this is... That was... This is... Oh. Isn't that right, Lucky? Can you walk a Sheba? Seems you can. What's the purpose of points, exactly? Eventually, run out of tokens. Oh, I don't get to actually play the game. Video games are surely a waste of time. And I'm glad you had fun. You were... You could not be saying that to the worst person, Isaac. I... I'm running out of fucking options, to be honest. Uh, Eric is... He's in the pain. Isaac, this isn't a great day, to be honest. Sundar is a bit of a... He's, I, don't, I don't really know about him. Um, he's coming on a bit strong, and then Mandy warned me about him, and then I don't really know much about Mandy, so I'm kind of weed out in the open. Like, Would you like to offer a gift? No, you shot all over my dreams last time I offered you a gift. So there we go, back to it. Oh, Bin. Bin. ATM? No. Okay, what's over here? Oh, big room. Ah. Jesus, boys. Jesus, the sound made them. Yeah, keep moving, keep moving. Still have one heal, still have one heal. It seems if I touch off them, I take damage, which is dodge, like. Right, TVs are mostly dead. The AoEs keep them coming. Ah. Whew. 
There we go. Oh, free coffee. Yeah, have a sup of that. Sugar. That was that was intense. That was scary. Um, right, I think I've done everything on this floor. I can go back down to the secret door I found. Ooh, wire. Token. Oh, I, <laughs> I didn't get what you meant. I was like, did I find a token? Yeah, pure token. Love token. Right, here we go. Secret tunnel. Secret tunnel. Oh, achievement. Find the monster shop. Oh. Wow, where are these? Am I safe here? Oh my god! Wow. Hey, dude. Ah. Vitas Varnas, monster. It seems you're worried the shop at the heart of Verona. Hmm? Oh. Are these gifts? Oh my god, look at the bomber jacket. Oh my god, look at the rose one. It's like the one I actually have in real life. I gotta buy this. Wait, I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna look around. And because I only have not a lot of money, but I will buy it uh, if there's nothing else for sale. Hey, guy. I gotta save up my money from the dungeon. Stop getting defeated by the likes of yous. This thing's daddy looking. I thought this place was exclusive. This is how this is so cute. Like, this is really funny. I, I really like this. Um, yeah, I'll buy that bomber jacket, please. The rose one. Thanks. Um, okay, you just mail it back to my apartment. I can't wear it now. Oh my god, that was so cool. Right. Cracking on. Isaac, of course. Rock my bay. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. Let's keep going. Let's keep this thing moving. Oh, TVs. I missed. Ah, yeah. Fucking. Oh, God. A giant phone. Big giant phones. Oh, I'm stuck. What the fuck? I can't roll. Oh, TV. Fucking giant phone. <sighs> oh my god, pure fucking boss fight. We're flying though. Oh, free coffee. So I'll take that. I'm sub that. I'm running low on coffees though. I seem to be going through them faster than I'm I'm uh, finding them. Right, nothing else around here. Nokia 3210. <laughs> Daddy phone. Yeah, fucking hell. Did you ever see the big huge ones from like Save by the Bell that are like the size of your head? Oh, up, 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 back me seven, back me seven, back me seven. Oh, no signs. Oh, I need to keep moving. Oh, up, 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 Jesus. Oof. Hydration is important. Hydro, homies. Cheeky Zion from my trouble. Some Mulan and some more Mulan. Coffee? No, Zion. I need to get. Uh, like, I'm, I'm obviously going deeper into the difficult part of the dungeon. Um, and I'm conscious of. How do I, like, do I have to die to get out or can I, like, leave? Oh, no. I'm gonna just keep going as far as I can. Don't think there's any penalty for dying. I'd say we've. Oh, look at this! So we've earned a bit of a rest. Um, have a sub of that. And get one back. And some money. And some money. And some. Who's throwing out all this loose change? Isaac's. I oh, he's considering. Mm. These look acceptable, are they? Mr. Fucking Snooty. Took a course of massage therapy. I could give you a massage if you like. Oh, go deep. Uh. <laughs> uh, excellent. I'll start off with your fingertips and work my way to the lower back. Oh, Isaac. You feel Isaac works to stress and tension out of your limbs, back, and neck. When he's finished, you feel a deep lethargy but renewed flexibility, too. Oh, oh that's my boy. How it was acceptable, might. Oh, <laughs> oh, will I say no happy ending? <laughs> oh, you'd have to, wouldn't you? I don't know. See, I don't want to squander. See, he was kind of. Yeah, I'm going to roll with this. Fuck it. Isaac flushes. 
I wasn't trained in massaging legs. Would you like to offer a gift? Um, no. Let's go back to the dungeon, shall we? Sweet. This game has it all. Dunk. Oh! That made it sound like I was getting fucking loads of money. I got like two dollars. <laughs> right, enemy goes. Oh no! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! So many! So many! So many! I hate the phones. The phones just come up on you like. Struggling. Oh, is this all she wrote? Is this all she wrote? Oh my god, so much turrets. What does the liquid do? Like, it's crafting my eyes. Stay over there. Back, I say. Back, I say. Whew. I'm not gonna lie, boys. I thought that was it. I thought that was lights out. That's a 20% increase, bro. Loads. What is the fucking liquid? Oh. Oh sorry, you have the coins I picked up. Yeah, I suppose you like you can't be you can't be too picky. Coffees. Coffees. I'm actually not that weak because like, you get seven back for each coffee and I'm on nine out of fourteen, so I'll save it. Okay, so up there is the way out, so I gotta check down this way. Whoa. Jesus. Fuck. Right, one down. Bip. Oh my god. This is really fucking stressful. Like, I'm proper sweating here playing it. I thought this was going to be like a quirky, fucking silly boyfriend dating thing with a bit of dungeon crawling but it's just an intense dungeon crawler with a weird fucking spin on it like I'm not safe this is whopper and I'm only gonna play this on stream so you don't have to worry about missing anything um while I'm away and this will hopefully keep us going between this and some DVD maybe Midnight Ghost Hunt this will keep us going until at least the 27th when the Stanley Parable finally comes out and then we can play that. I'm very excited for a Stanley Parable. It's going to be a lot of fun. Right, new one, new dungeon. Level five. I, I'd be surprised now. Can I leave? Oh, maybe, maybe I'll just call it there. Can I go? What's that? Oh, am I locked? Am I locked? The gate's closed. Maybe we can find a key nearby. Oh, is this a, that's an exit. Oh, okay, so you can only go down. Um, the, what's that? The Stanley Parable. Oh, what? Is, how do you describe the Stanley Parable? The Stanley Parable. Oh, battle my fears. Boss fight. Stanley Parable is a mod that was made for Half Life, I believe, in which you play the role of an employee working in a company, um, and you there's a narrator narrating your movements in the game, and you just have to. Oh, whoops. Well. There's a narrator narrating your movements in the game and you can either listen to the narrator or ignore the narrator. So he might say like, Stanley got up from his desk and left the room via the door on the left. But you can go through the door on the right. And then the narrator might be like, Stanley didn't listen to the narrator. He went back into the room and did what he was told. And it's all about, it's multiple endings, multiple choices. You can go through it and uh, you know, there's loads of different things you can do, different routes you can take and stuff. And it's just really fun. It was out a while ago. Uh, as the mod and it's been remastered now and it's coming out on the 27th and they're adding in loads of cook content way more like endings and routes you can take and stuff i'm really excited for it it's a cheap little thing but it was, it was really really good and i played it a couple of years ago so i'm looking forward to not only going back to it but going back to the cook content that we didn't have before i'd like to practice some more parries i often practice at the mission care to join me okay now we're Okay, I mean, Sanctuary of Santa Dogo. Mama. I was so worried when you went off to VB on your own, but you're doing great. Facing fears, finding friends. I'm amazed. It makes me proud. My little baby bird flying on his own. It's hard without you, man. It is. It's tough. I miss you. I know, sweetheart. You're doing something really hard and brave, but this is important. And independence is part of growing up. I'll be here when you need me. 
you'll always be my son. This game, guys. Fuck me. Sweet. Right. Let's go see the potential fat girl. Was thinking of going to the park, you free? Sounds good. See you by the pond. Okay. Right, I gotta look good. And I just know what to wear. Oh, look at that. <sighs> Get the hair out. Oh, that's real fresh. I'm real happy I got that. Goes out the turban as well, but it looks a bit too uh, eastern. So I'm going to keep the head, the turban off. And yeah, that's nice. I like that. I like that. Uh, craft. Oh, yeah, I can craft some shit now. Um, I only have the one fucking recipe, though. Fried macro recipe. Where's the bracelet? Oh, boo. Oh, I can make loads of shit. Can I craft another bracelet? Oh, I have three. Okay. Oh, no, I don't. I can only craft the one. Oh, I have a bracelet because Isaac gave it back to me. Pepperoni pizza recipe. Sugar and a wire. Fried macro recipe. Sugar and a wire. Okay. Oh, okay, I'm not making the recipe. I'm using the recipe to make the fried mackerel. Looking dapper. Oh, I love that emo. Oh, my God. <laughs> and, oh, okay, I made fried mackerel. Fried mackerel. I'm going to pizza, too. That way, we're fully equipped to give this Valerie Mott whatever she wants. If she's fat, we give her the food. If she's not, we give her the bracelet. Sound good? I'm such a pig. Right. Oh, shit, wait, it's at the pond, wasn't it? Oh, yeah, here we go. All right. Wow me. Oh, she's cured. She's not all chipped and stuff. I won't pick it up because she told me to pick it up without consent. So I'm just going to say hello. Okay, right, she's not fat. She's better looking than Mandy. She looks like um, your average fucking... Uh, you know, like rangery womany from a fantasy film or something. You know what I mean? What's the word I'm looking for? Vagabond? Ah, that's huh? better. She stops to give you a piercing look up huh? and down. I really didn't get a proper look at you back in the dungeon. You're cute. Do you like me, Jackie? Oh, I just got it yesterday. You too. To tell the truth, I got a little dressed up. Thanks. Thanks for meeting me in public. I know you're the one who rescued me, but I still don't know how I got down there. Or how my blade got chipped. It's an ironic twist. Someone's clearly backstabbed me, so I'm a little jumpy. Sexy Aragorn. Yeah, we'll go with that. <laughs> the fucking... The pee Pepe thing. I'll never not laugh at them. Like, I love the pee one. Just a little gradual pool of piss coming out. Besides safety, just in case... Safety for us, just in case you're an axe murderer, mm. though I suppose you're more likely to just turn out to be an axe. Not that it'd be a problem if you were. That'd be hypocritical, giving my own... She leans closer and lowers her voice dramatically. Situation. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> you know your deal, you can tell me. I won't judge you. I just prefer to know up front before anything happens. Oh, so something's gonna happen? Oh, come on, we both know why you came here, what you're hoping for. Oh, do we? We do. Why did you? They're saying, all right, so we're in. It's on the plate. She's keen. Who is this? A man approaches hiding you. He, straight out of the gate, is the one who abducts people. Look at him, he's wounded. He's grubby. Hello. Okay. Everything all right, V? Mm -hmm. Yeah, everything's peachy, thanks. See you later. Man stares down a moment long from moving um... on. That's a friend checking in see how I've been axe murdered. Don't like that. Look, don't take this the wrong way, but your story's too convenient. You're from out of town, a newbie, never dated before. Yeah, you're all so charming and apparently great at combat. Something doesn't add up. Nobody's called me charming. Huh. That's sweet, but I have trouble believing it. The truth is, we barely know each other. You know you have to say something and never see her again. Get to know me then. You feel a little breathless at your own daring, but Valeria's eyes warm a little. I suppose that's why I came to Verona Beach. New start, new friends. Looking for fun, friendship, and maybe more. And if you turn out to be an evil mastermind, keep your enemies close, all right? Right. <laughs> Say la vie. Would you like to offer a gift? Yes. She's not fat and she has lots of bangles on her wrists, so she likes bracelets. So give her the bracelet. Yes, boys. <laughs> you have a good eye. Thank you. Ciao. That was nice. That was good. 
Part of me was like, well, she has all the bracelets, but she doesn't have any fish or pizza, so maybe I'll give it that. We got good. Find a rose on your doorstep, mm, Sunder. Oh, fuck off, Eric. Stop harassing me. Carry inside, take a dump on it. Fuck off. Such a scrub bike. I don't like him at all. Hey, what's up? Having a good day? Don't send me things. Go away, Eric. No need to thank me. Man like you deserves appreciation. My business is doing well, so I'm generous. Come by the shop sometime. If you don't hate me. Well, then I hope you can infer what happens when I don't come by your shop. Valeria. Next time, a real date. One where I don't accuse you of being a murderer. Or an axe, though I know. I knew a nice one once. Anyway, I think my blade is mostly healed. Glad to hear it. She's typing. Thanks. I'll let you know when I think of a date we can go on. Let's go to the dunge in the meantime. <gasps> smooth, boys. We went. We did it. We did well today. Played it nice and smooth. Nothing from Mama Bear. Um, can we craft that? No, not craft. No new signs. Uh, still the same day, so I think we can go hop in the dunge. Oh no, we could probably see Isaac. Or can I go back to uh, um, level five of the dunge? I wonder. I don't have to start at level one. I gotta see Isaac do this, and then we hop in the dunge for the rest of the day. Oh wow, I like this background. Hmm. Parry is actually a bit too consistent. What? Try going a bit slower or faster, or try a new parry direction. Surprise at the spice of life and fencing. Go on, take a stab at it. Uh. Paradigly. Yes, just like that. Perfect form. Just lovely. Are you flirting with me? Mm -mm. Certainly not. I I mean, I do think you're attractive, but I mean, the comment purely professionally, I assure you. Now, oh, let us resume. <laughs> now, practice lunging, Isaac. Don't you panic. You even have me sweating. And yeah. He doesn't spare you an inch. He deflects every trust, easily knocking them aside and scoring on you. <laughs> I love the sounds. Oh, we love the... I hope it didn't frustrate you. I just want to see your true level. We learned most of them. We're challenged after all. I didn't mean to show off. I get patient sometimes, I suppose. Ah. <laughs> and you handled me rather well, I must say. I'll handle you any day, buddy. Repost timing is more forgiven. Okay, so. Uh, and repost max enemies back for it. All right, so. Mm -hmm. We're on it. We continue to take a break. How are you feeling? Fencing gear suits oh. you. <clears throat> Let's take a break, yes. Takes off his fancy jacket, looking around. And my mother raised me in this church. It's kind of, he's raised in a church. She was as kind as your mother, it sounds like, but she did some things right. She came for the community. My dog is wiggling on the bed. She's dreaming in her sleep. She came for the community mostly, but I took to it more deeply. There's so many mysteries in this life, Cody. Some people suffer. Others become swords. A purpose is helpful. Do you believe in a god of some kind? I don't know. I don't know. Questioning and open-mindedness are important. Even so, I hope you decide one day. Belief can be really strengthening in one way or the other. At least we can agree that love is power. Not just lust, real, generous, mm. patient love. I'd like to think that love can connect anyone, no matter what deity we believe in or don't. There are so many suffering people, I just want to help them all. I don't like business, but it's a tool, the powerful one in our society. I started Brooks Associates to tackle wealth and equality, but most wealthy people aren't interested. God, fucking soliloquy. Anyway, I want to thank you for handling my father so gracefully before. Vince could be a difficult man. Lots of saber rattling. He was a prick, and I'm going to tell you as much. Why don't you stand up to him? <sighs> Hit a nerve. He wants what he thinks is best. Still, I should try to say something, but no matter how sharp I get, I can never get a word in. How do you work up the courage to go into the dunge even when you're afraid? I just plunge in. Oh? Yeesh, tried that with Vince as a teenager and it didn't end well. I think I still have a scar on my hilt from that scuffle. It was an accident, but still, Jesus. Alas, poor Yorick. I knew him, Horatio. So, he, he has a scar from a tussle with Vincent. Uh, does that mean Vincent is a weapon person as well? And like, can weapons give birth to other weapons? This is, this is intriguing. We all have our own strategies for survival. Even in human form, I find it easier to parry than to go on the offensive. Crowd starts filtering in. Perhaps a service will start soon. Oh? 
Our time already have flies. Next time, make sure we don't get interrupted. I would not like to offer a gift. Ah, come on, you can have my pizza. How can I refuse such a thoughtful gesture? Thank you, Cody. Good day. Be well. I head home. Oh, another date. It's just like Tinder. I found another date if I'm here already. Where? It'll be fine. Go to Paradise Lost tomorrow at noon. She'll wear a blue jacket. Great. Wonder if it's Mandy. Don't forget to smile. Thanks, Jesse. Oh, sorry. Face smiles are bad, but never. Oh, but face smiles are bad. Never mind. Smiling optional. Okay, thank you. Thank you for coming to practice. I'm so pleased with your progress. I've had a good practice. I feel good with how practice went today. What's the right emoji to use? Uh, celebrate. Okay. Thanks, Isaac. Let's go to the dungeon. Um, I'm going to go with Valeria, I think, but I'm not going to tell you that. Uh, yeah, I'm not going to go with you either. Let's go to the dungeon in the meantime. Okay. I'm out of here dungeon crawling. <laughs> That prick over there, could stay there. Right, where do we? Valeria. Here we go. Sunder, Isaac, Valeria. I'm not even taking Eric as an option. I don't want to fucking have any business with him. He's a wanker. It's nice that we can start at level five now. Verona Mall has seen better days, huh? It has, dear, it has. <laughs> what combos are we looking at? Oh, this is the fucking this is my thing. I'm liking this. One, two, three, four. Okay, so it's light, 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 heavy, light, light, heavy, heavy, light, heavy, 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 heavy. So it's one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And one, two, three, four. No bother remembering that. Battle my fears. Oh, this is where I died last time. Shalak him. Oop. Whoa. Oh, that's not oh, They're very strong. Oh. I'm trying to parry them, but they're fucking me up. Oh, I can't parry with this. It's weapon based. I forgot. I'm not using the e-stock. Eyes ahead. Coffee, 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 coffee. Oh. Ow. Come on, boys. Ugh. I need some more fucking range to me. I need some zines. Big damage. Yup. Oh, I got the key. And the gold chain. Oh, wonder if Valeria liked that. Mall gate is apparently unlocked. Nice. All right, we did it. We did it, boys. Grab this health. All right. All right. Level five. So now if we die, we can just start here without having to fight that boss or anything. These shops, though. I do like this dagger, it does a lot of damage. Compared to the other stuff. Get that coffee from my troubles. Get some money from my troubles. 90 cent. We're never going to the opera. I wouldn't mind taking a breather. Oh, this is nice. Huh? Reminiscent of Steinlin, but even more poppy and mainstream. Probably just a lazy knockoff, but it's possible the artist is knowingly commenting on the commercial placement to be nice if the piece were both pretty and honest. They're both important components. When you say in uh, art, of course, both are essential. <laughs> I am. <laughs> we're doomed if you're a liar, even just as friends. I guess we'll find out sooner or later. No gift offering. Okay, that's fine, because I, I would like to give her the gold necklace, but I haven't made it yet, and I'm not going to go home. 
So she's getting the fish. Oh shit. Get out of my face, enemies. I fear nothing with this dagger now. I'm invincible. I found my true love. Oh, gold save. A fine bourbon recipe. Oh, big stacks, fetch stacks, two dollar deals, look at that. Have you taken that? Take that home with you. Not a safe. But Into the loot stack. Vodka. No dollar deals this time around. Bad nothing. Bad in the slap in the air. Smart we came in with. Uh, it's this way. Oh, oh, just, oh, oh god! Oh, my fucking telephone. Okay, just one boy on earth. Melt. Die, bitch. Ring, ring, you're dead. 50% off BOGO. Okay, whatever that is. Right, and we're back down. The music is whopper. I really hope it's stream friendly. There's no option to like turn it off or whatever for the stream, so I'm hoping it's just G to not get me muted. Oh. Fucking die. Come on, boys. What are we doing? Going over here. Fight him in the light. Fight him in the light. Wait, I don't know why they lose sight of me like that. I wonder if some kind of buff I have on, but look, I'm not complaining. Ta-da! Another floor down for the count. Thank you, beautiful Valeria. Oh, free coffee. Once. Full health, full heals. Let's fucking go, boys. Another one. Wow. Uh, this is, I did everything here, didn't I? Yeah. Yeah, keep with Valeria. Oh wait, love Max. Wait for a date invitation. Okay. Uh, oh, the question marks of Valeria's passive. Okay, sound. I like that. I really like this dagger. I need to get a date invitation. But I'm gonna keep going to get some money into me anyway. Oh, so many enemies. So many enemies. Fucking die. <laughs> We're getting it. We're doing it, boys. Right. Kashish. Loop around. Loop around. Loop around. Doesn't know where I'm coming from. Doesn't know where I'm coming from. Bang, 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 bang. This is the best game ever. <laughs> Move over Elden Ring. Goatee 2022. I'm actually having so much fun. It's so dumb. <laughs> God. Oh my god. Ooh. Coffee. Ouch. Oh no. Alright, these are these fellas are giving me the business. Oh. Die. Sweet. This was close to sneaking Goaty off. It takes two from me. It's a dark horse. It is Whopper like. <laughs> That's the sound of it. Like it's just dungeon crawlers are always great, but the weird little spin of like getting dates and people being weapons is just gas. Like, hats off to you for the recommendation, Dale. I'm a big fan. Music in it is Whopper as well. Oh, challenge room. Do it, come on, give it to me, give me your all. Okay, I'm way bigger than the, biz the other one. <laughs> Die. It's so simple. 
Did, did I get it? Achievement, give a per- oh, hey, hey, hey. Give a perfect gift. That popped fairly late. Challenge complete. Okay, two tiers to the challenge. That was a bit close. I ran out of heels there. I need more coffee. Need more coffee, guys. Wire, wire, wire do birds. Suddenly appear. Dush. Oh, 212. Look at that. 35 big ones. That's not bad. Rolling in the money. So glad I don't have to eat. We're going up north. What's over here? Oh, back in Togan. Finally, a monster free zone. Do you like video games? Arcades are romantic, in a huh? way. Machines become my days almost as soon as they're made, you know? Oh, God, there's a word. They're ephemeral. Always replaced by something newer and better. Though there's some charm in older games as a window to the past. If you squint, pixel art has a lot in common with pointillism or mosaics. Do you ever play older games? Lots. Huh? An antiquarian of sorts, then. Maybe we should visit a game museum sometime. Why for now? She's strongly out in front compared to the rest of them, I won't lie. For now, we gotta get back into the fight and show those monsters who's boss. Okay, babe. Let's do it. Cash. 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 Oh. Go. Uns, uns, uns. Oh, loud them, loud them, loud them, loud them. We got this, though. They just like, you have to keep moving, create space, or else they just surround you and you're in trouble. Like, Wah. they do so much damage now. I can keep in cover. Done and dusted. And that's the kind of excitement we're getting out of bed for. Look at that, full heels. Full health, loads of sugar, loads of money in my fucking pocket. And we're done on this floor. What a well rounded trip. What floor are we on? Seven. Let's get oh no, we can. Alright, we can just bounce home now. I gotta bounce home now. I think I can. Can I go back to. Uh... Level 7? I hope I can. Jeez, look at all them dead boys. Nice! Not too bad, not too bad, not too shabby at all at all. Level 7 now. I hope I can go back. Just like... I had an idea, do you like museums? Yeah. Meet me at the museum? Wear something red. Seriously? <laughs> Just kidding, wear whatever you want. <laughs> I like our moxie. I'm already wearing red though, so. Well, I'm wearing rose. Yeah, I'm gonna st stick what I'm wearing because it's fucking baller and I spent good money on it. Uh, still no new signs. Crafting. Alright, here we go, boys. Let's, let's figure this out now. Yeah, we craft that. That's a lot of wire, actually. I didn't really think that through. She'll like that, though. Vodka, I don't have the carpet. Fine bourbon, I don't have enough glass. And that's it, is it? I don't have enough glass. Can I make a bracelet anymore? Do I still have a bracelet? I thought I gave her the bracelet. Okay. Um, right. Wear something red. I'm wearing out here. To the museum. You find Valeria in the lobby and she leads you into hmm. the museum. She glares at daggers on the sculptures. It's too perfect. Perfection is so boring. I don't fucking trust it, lads. You're saying I'm not perfect? Uh, no, that's too pick me. Beauty is boring. I prefer paintings. I don't like any of these options. Um, Beauty is boring, is blatantly disagreeing with her, so that's not, that's, that's gonna piss her off. I'm not perfect. It's between I'm not perfect or I prefer paintings. 
all that kind of blatant disagreement here. This is kind of cringe, but I don't know if she'll vibe with that or not. I'm gonna rock with this. Huh? Yup. Got that. Of course, your perfection itself. Uh, so you don't trust me? <laughs> wow, I really got myself into trouble here, huh? Let's just say I'm working on it. Related guide guides to the museum without a map. According to our whim. Would you like to offer a gift? Yes. This is for you to go with the rest of your necklaces that you have. Oh, that's thoughtful of you. Thanks so much. She talks about art with intimate fondness, like their eccentric oh. family members. Just wondering, if you could steal a painting from any museum, which would it be? <laughs> Are you a cop? Uh, that is a loaded question. That's my favorite kind of question you've never thought about before. I'd steal the Birth of Venus by Bouguereau. It's in the Musée d'Orsay, ground floor near yeah. the stairs. The real issue is the size. It's 3 by 2.18 meters, and it'll be a crime to roll it up. Stealing it is a crime, but you've thought this huh? through. Well, it wouldn't do to get caught, would it? Probably not. I'd miss out on my chance to enjoy my painting if I was in prison. Now, it's your turn. What would you liberate? Um, well, I only know the Mona Lisa, and I've only seen the Mona Lisa in person. I don't even know of the other two. So, I'm just say nice and safe, plain vanilla Mona Lisa. I avoid, I avoid the lure of these days. Too touristy, am I right? You have to steal that one yourself, I'm afraid. I hate museums as much as I love them. The idea of them anyway. Art should be free out in the world, not hidden away like this. All right, it's not a fucking zoo. Uh. Around the beach isn't so bad. The museum's free and open to the public. Have you heard about the new mural at the mall? Maybe we could go look at it together sometime. I'd love to know what you think. People are saying it's the Roses of Venus. You know, the anonymous graffiti artists. Maybe they thought Around the Beach needed a little more beauty and love. Uh. Just you're getting to know her better, her attention wanders. You look around, see what's distracting her, and wait, this grubby guy, I fucking knew it. He's standing at the gallery entrance, glaring at you both. Uh, What's going on here, like? I'm sorry, I'll take care of this. You owe me an explanation, Valeria. They look intimate, like they've known each other forever. Are they swingers? Might have been recruited. She looks flushed and angry. Uh, Do you want to get out of here? You mean, go home with you? Sure. Yeah. Right. So, uh, like, uh, what's... Uh, enemies are confused longer. Ralph further. Okay. I got this one. Uh, yeah. So what do you say? Hell yes. Took, you take Valeria home <laughs> to her apartment. Oh, boys. <laughs> Should clash to turn off the stream. She's confident and she knows what she wants. She figures out quickly what you want to... After, oh, so we're done. It's already done. Done, does it. One pump jump. That's it. That's over. It's finished. After, she snuggles into you. you hit her hilt perfect in your palm. You're warm. Did I just bang a dagger? Or was she in human form? Or is hilt another word for arse? You're warm and cozy and soon fall asleep. And in the morning, she's gone. Of course she is. You up. Drama. New phone. Ah, it looks simpy. I want to see you again, but I need to think. Let's just dunge for a while. Let's. Dagger porn. Quite the thorn in my side. Okay. I wonder what's going on there. She needs to make her mind up. Um, I need to get some fucking materials. What are we wearing today, boys? What are we feeling? Uh, I have worn this black dress. This is nice. Or have more. Have I worn that? I did wear that. I have worn this. Wear that with the bucket hat. Or the turban. Or the nothing. I have got turban. We are eccentric today. Eric can fuck off. Um, I just go straight back into the dungeon, I think. Or I have a look at the shop. I haven't looked down south. I've yet to explore the actual town. Okay, can't go that way. I'm just a giant boy looking across all the buildings. Uh, Paradise Lost. Who was the? Oh, Paradise. Who was? Who was this? I just get it. Oh, Jesse set me up on a date, and I have to go with Paradise Lost and see who it is. Okay, so look, look, we're not exclusive with Valeria. I'm seeing whatever's going down. I'm Olivia. What kind of cats do you like? You're the lady from Kicks. Uh, I'm not a cat person. Really? Weird. Hmm. Do you want to order coffee? I'm me. Yeah, don't you work at Kicks? <laughs> Mm. It's you. Ah, oh, okay. This is my date. Is she like a scout or something? P 
Pokemon trainer. This is kind of a day, but it doesn't have to be. We can just hang and pet cats. I don't really like dates anyway. You must play some game of trying to guess the right thing to say. And then you flirt and you're supposed to just start kissing. It's all so fake. Totally get you. Are you just playing a dating game? I'll never know. Olivia frowns slightly. Frowns slightly. I was focused in the distance. Wait, don't look behind you, but someone's watching us in the window. If it's this grubby fella. They're gone. Maybe I was imagining things. It's that fucking grubby fella who's following Valeria. An elegant cat walks up and sits nearby, staring at you curiously. Huh? I don't recognize this one. Who are you, kitty? Are you new here? She's so cute. May I pet you, perhaps? Cat stalks away, tail in the air. Ooh, swing and a miss. This is such a weird date. That was nice. See you around. I'll walk you home. Uh -uh. Oh, I, I wasn't trying to, you know, infer anything. Um, I was just being a gentleman. Uh, okay, no problem. So if any of my friends come say, I'll let you know. Yeah, sure, that's that's fine. Cat gives you a pitying, pitying look. It's no one's fault. I wasn't, you know, wasn't really vibing with her anyway. Just thought it'd be nice to walk her home, and then she didn't want me to, so that's fine. Hopefully it's dangerous out there, you know, just be safe. You head home. Oh, this fucker. Are you stalking me? How do you know this, like? No way is he, is he, is he the sus. I've been there. I know how it feels to be rejected. Do you? Because you don't seem to fucking get the picture. Do you think they're so much better than us? But they're not. You're better than all of them. You deserve to be treated like a king, Cody. Please fucking stop. Hey, <laughs> sorry if I'm awkward, I say too much, you're just so handsome. Yeah, no thanks, Eric. No fucking thanks. How'd it go with Olivia? Uh, we're friends, maybe? Oh, sweet. Friends are the best. This is progress. Just think, a few weeks ago, you never dated anyone. Now you have experience and skills. If you want to change up your weapon combos, check out the gym in town, and the most romantic holiday ever is around the corner. Valentine's. Surely. No, 4th of July. <laughs> Nothing's more romantic than a barbecue and fireworks. Of course. Sure, Jesse, I'll humour you, because Eric was mean to you, and you're nice. And I look forward to your texts. You think I'm joking, but wait and see. I met my partner Samantha at a barbecue. It's gold. You'll be all kissy face. I'll send you details soon. No bother, buddy. Happy to wait. Right, dungeon. Dungeonicious, definitions make the boy. Oh, Jim. Jim, 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 Jim. Uh, Valeria. We should green our tactics. Yeah, that's, that's, that's fine. Oh, is that all that is? You can just change your fucking loadout, basically. Okay. Hit the gym. Jesse has a serious closet full of lonely mates to pedal at you. Yeah, who are you telling? I don't mind it, though. I'm all for it. Uh, once it's, um, once they're actually keen. The dog's just staring at me. Here you go. Hey. This feels dangerous. I like it. Oh, baby. Oh, baby, I love you. Way. Right, back to it. Oh, ow, 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 ow. Ah, mom, stop dropping the bar, bro. What's over here? Crate. Crate. Ah. Oh. Vending machine. I fucking was about to like this thing. I forgot the word for vending machine. Trash. Trash. Uh, right, so I'll just see what's available here. Vending machine have several choices. Yeah, you monster shop, yeah? Sweet. Go down there and see what they have for sale. Whoa, baby. Fucking die, stupid technology. Box in the corner, box in the corner. Done and dusty. How was your sister? And we're going up here. Oh, feel like a break? Sure thing. Anything for you, uh -huh. Valeria. Reminiscent of style. Oh, again. Exact same thing. Uh, okay, so I don't want to play it safe, so I prefer honesty. Mm -hmm. Yup. Nice one. You and me, we're dealing with your liar. I guess we'll find out sooner or later. 
Uh, do I have it? Ooh, I, I can't see our liking this. I cannot see our liking this. Had to go to work for a bit. Did you find a boyfriend yet? Well, oh my goodness. So, you've missed so much. Eric is completely out the window. He's a prick. He starts slagging Jesse. Don't know if you saw that. So, that was straight away out the window. Nobody slags my cousin. Haven't really seen much of Sunder much. He came on a bit too strong and I binned him. Not really feeling that. Uh, Isaac still teach me uh, sword fighting. That's fine. He's grand. But we're really making strides with a new woman called Valeria, who is actually really a good weapon, a really good weapon. Um, and we're putting in the groundwork with her currently. So we're going to give her some mackerel because we're out of all the jewelry that she likes. But I kind of just want to get rid of this mackerel anyway. So, oh, well, she likes the mackerel. Oh, thank you, really. I, I was really expecting him to be like, ugh, what you give me this for? So happy days. I also got a cool new bomber jacket, which I don't have at the minute. I've got a kind of Eastern thing going on with my stripes and my turban at the moment. Um, it's been a fashiony week. And I got a oh, challenge room. Okay, leave that coffee there because I might need it. Uh, right, me phones. Somebody call for help. <laughs> Did you get it? I love that passive way they get stunned. Like, really handy. And I get some wire. Oh, new safe. And a boot with my sock. <laughs> I don't know why I like it so much. Oh, the mall isn't so bad when it's with you. Sleepy time, Zion. Oh, cool. New Zion. Right, where was the... Uh... Let's go this way next, because I haven't been this way. And then the door at the monster shop is back the way we came. Oh, God, no. Oh, God. Oh, my God, oh, my God, oh, my God. Fuck you. Oh, it's so overwhelming. So overwhelming. Keep them boxed over the hole. Corral them a bit. Fuck you, video. Right, these guys gotta go. Okay, I just missed them completely. What's my mouse doing? Okay. Oof, my health. Okay, good breathing room. Coffee, coffee. Who's got the coffee? Crit. Right. And there is a cup. Back. No. I'm, I'm maxed out my head. Okay. So that's this. No, there's not. Ow. Why did I do that? Nearly there. Nearly there, folks. Nearly there. I stand Sunder. Nah, Sunder's out the window, man. Why do you see Valeria? Look at all the weapons. I, the attacks I can do with her. Swap her. Four stack canvas. Oh, some shoe grit. Right. To the monster shop. What's that? Nah, it's just ambience. Da -da 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 I went up there to the left. So I get it. Yeah, it's the oh I need to go south as well. Just to see what's over there. We'll come back to it, don't panic. I'm just gonna go see what's down here. Oh, it seems to loop around, which be handy. Yeah, grab that. Righty. Uh, it's gonna loop. It's looking like it. Yes, it's looping. Oh, mucho de enemigos. Ah. All right, not a bother, not a bother, not a bother. Right, we're back up. So that means we can just bounce out to the right and hit up the monster shop. If it still is the monster shop, or it's a different type of shop, I don't know about. All right, here's the boys. Okay, so it's the exact same as last time. Oh, no. Oh, hello, man! Ah, you couldn't have just summoned Danny DeVito. <laughs> How long have you been fucking saving up for that one? <laughs> oh. I fucking regret putting that one on. Does he have new stock? Uh, no, he doesn't. Don't worry, you want to get another bomber jacket. Bold lipstick. Oh, see, who'd like to... Oh, yeah, one fucking... Valeria, I'd love the camera, wouldn't she? Art. P. 
pictures, paintings, shit like that. Revenge. <laughs> you're getting yourself a boyfriend, eh? Scott, look, we're open, all right? At the moment, we're putting the graft in with a girl, but we've had multiple eligible male bachelors coming on to us, all of which have kind of let me down, if I'm honest. I'm really upset with Isaac. Um, but I still, I, still, I still be friends with Isaac But yeah look look, We'll just we'll, we'll roll with it right? I'm trying to get up the relationship To get another date with the old dagger um, Let me see If you don't know what that means People are basically daggers Or weapons So there is Valeria But she can also turn into a dagger And like Using her in the dungeon as the weapon Gets my relationship up with her And then she'll ask me on a date It's a really fucking weird game But it's fun like Oh, th thank you so much for the one bit, Scott. I really appreciate it. You don't have to donate every time you're here, but it's very much appreciated. So thank you very much, bro. You're too good. I don't know why the alert is uh, delayed. Or it might be, I don't know if I have, after watching John's getting kind of hockeyed over by people putting, you know, giving him one bit 20 times, I might have made the minimum threshold a bit higher so I don't get trolled. But um, it's very much appreciated regardless, bro. Thank you. Oh, you up friends on fabric. I can make vodka now for whatever reason. Ah! Okay, no iframes on the dodge. Lovely. Oh, it's just a door. Can I, can I go down? Oh, this is to the... Oh, challenge room. Oh, wrecking ball. Find a shortcut. I know you guys can't see it, but you can hear it popping up and I'm getting a little thing on the right-hand side of my screen with uh, the Xbox overlay. It's telling me I have an achievement, so that's what that pops in. Is. Come on. Lay it on me. Whoa, hey, 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 hey. Ah, oh, God, they hit her. Whoa, back up. One more. Unless it's a second level. There is. The horde. Oh, I'm low on heals. Any heals? Oh, there's a coffee. Take that. Right, here we go. Whoa, no. Shit. Oh, Valeria, watch your tongue. Batteries, tear up. Right, this is us. Yes, boys. Need some more heels. Bump. Gourmet cupcake. Oh, I'm starving now. Fashion sign. Fashion sign. <gasps> I need to go check these out. What floor am I on? Floor eight. I'll try to go to ten. I don't want to go and see what's the crack with all my new crafties. Oh, so this is just a this is just a little side project job. If I go back out to the actual the actual mall. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh, very long heels. Very long heels. Ah! Oh, boys! No! <laughs> No! Oh, still not enough for another date, lads. Especially with carry on like that. Can't be fainting in front of the ladies. Oh, no, wait. Oh, so close. So close. 142 out of 150. Like, go home. The fucking the heartbeat sound is uh, scary, like. You gotta be careful with stuff like that. Can't be playing it too hard now in the dungeons, like. Best from Jessa. Almost got you another day, but I need... Okay, relax, let me read it. But I need some info. Be honest. Would you rather get to know a guy who's buff or sweet? Oh, thank you very much for the three bits. I really appreciate it. Uh, I don't know why the alert didn't pop up. I feel like it's... It, it, stream Elements has been ropey the past couple of days. Um with the alert so it's either mega delayed or the threshold is too low because I didn't want you know and maybe it might be five bits or whatever I'm not sure I'll have a fiddle with it after but either way thank you very much for the bits I really appreciate it. every bit is appreciated right I know it's only a couple of cents but I really appreciate it. just you guys give me anything a follow alone is, is amazing so thank you 
Anyway, almost got you another date, but I need some info. Be honest, would you rather get to know a guy who's buff or sweet? Buff, sweet, swords only, more info. How we feel? Buff, buff. All right, buff, buff it is. Okay, well, it was a trick question because this dude is sweet and buff. His name is Jonah and he's the best. How'd you know? You date him then, approved. Well, no, because uh, he has a partner called Samantha already. Cody love when people whip out their bits for them because they look at your bits. I won't be home from work around 12, so I'll probably miss it, but I'll hop on as soon as I'm in the mushing fox. But we could always just delay it. I'm up for delaying it. I don't know if anybody else is, but... Um, yeah, Chris, see what you feel if we could delay the quiz or whatever. Uh, how do you know that he's the best? We used to... Oh, he... Okay. We used to date a while back, way before Samantha. He was really fun. He'd be a good friend, I think, no matter what happens. Uh, I don't want to date your ex... Yeah, I don't want to take your ex. It'll just be friendly meeting, of course. No pressure. Talk to you soon. Okay, so that, that I'm just locked into that. I can't get over that. That's it. I literally don't have any other progress until I level up Valeria. I need to get a date, like. Um, oh, I might just hop back in the dungeon, keep grinding to level 10. Oh, what was that? Is there something new in the ship? The ballet company is coming to town. I want to go to the ballet. Oh, I never did my fucking uh, zines, lads. Go back to the gaff. And I don't hang around for me. Sure, you just go ahead and I'll join when I get in and just give myself full points for the rounds I missed. Well, look, it's Chris's gig. I'm easy either way. Whatever he decides to do. Uh, zines. Oh, it's crafting, do I? Uh, zines. Sleepy time zine. Oh, I can't make my vodka then. Fuck a new zine be nice. Dom 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 dom. Uh, go on, make up cakes. I love the little crafting noise. Fine bourbon. Yeah. Isaac would like that, I think. That's us. Dark essence. She make it sound like we're not up to stupid errors anyway, allegedly, Rhino. He's got you there, Kels. We are all creatures. Right. Yeah, I'm so close to getting her. Oh, I fucking know it. Five, seven. I should. Okay, so it's if you willingly go back in the lift. I think. I'm going to test that. I'm going to get the floor well, eight. Here we go. Here we go, indeed. But Friday night energy. I'm just gonna try and go straight through this because I've done it already. Ah. I never quit my fucking Zion, lads. <laughs> Oh, I'm such bad in. Right, where's the fucking steps? Oh, I gotta go through the chat in the room, do I? Oh my god. Get away, eat me. Better go do some work. Thank you, Kelsey. Thank you for the lurk. I'll see you later. Feeling like a break. Oh my god, it's all the same with this mod. Uh, honestly, mm -hmm. yeah, you like that. Okay, so that, that should be enough to get her up then. Um, if I just find some stairs, blitz down to level eight. I don't want to do that. Uh, oh, there's a door over here. Stairs. Oh, it's safe. Look, we won't say no, it's safe. Chemistry sign. Ooh. Cheeky coffee. Ah, fuck, we do this while we're here. Yep. Like fucking clockwork, boys. I need to find the stairs. I'm going to look down. Oh, have I gone this way? Uh, I haven't. 
get that on my face so I can see. I need to find the stairs so I can just see if if I just get to level eight and then hop back in the lift, does it remember that I've got to level eight? Like why did it remember that I got to level seven but not level eight? Do you get me? Because I like, I died at level eight, but I didn't die at level seven. So that's, I just want to test my theory. I'm getting punched around. Oh my heels. some heels. Right, so oh, there's a heel. Right, we can we're we're we're, we're good. I'm gonna sneeze. <coughs> oh I'm very sorry, excuse me. I didn't even feel that cook and I'm at waking up the dog. I'm sorry, go back to sleep. I didn't feel that one cooking. Right, lovely some fabric. Ah, right, here's the, here's the, uh, the stairs. So, we go next level. Wait, what well, if there's no, ah, okay, if there's no lift. Now I get it, I get it, I get it. Right, so we're just leveling up Valeria at the moment. God, he hit so hard, boys. Jeez, what I, I need to just walk right into that, like. Right, we got a sign. We'll travel. Hey, Dave. Welcome in, brah. You're just in time to watch the latest goatee. This game is a whop, I'm on if you haven't played it. Can't recommend it enough. It's on Game Pass as well. All thanks to Dilly Willy. Oh, oh, God, that was dangerous. Oh, we still have a coffee. Some sugar there. Oh yeah, I played this on release. It's deadly crack. If you change your weapons after you max one out, you can work on leveling with the other ones if you want to. Uh, Dylan, I am insulted to think that you would ever think I have eyes for anyone other than my dear sweet Valeria. No, yeah, good show. I might do that actually when I'm finished the rip. Um, how do I change weapon? Is it inventory? Or it was just uh, when I go to a new fucking uh, level, I know what you mean. I know what you're saying. I know what you're saying. Uh, yeah, Dave, it's actually Whopper. I can't get out. I, I was really intrigued to play it. It's I, it's so different to what I thought it was gonna be. But uh, I'm actually having great crack with it. Like, oh, I'm so weak, boys. I'm so weak. Oh, boy, I was... got the date though. That's all that matters. Level 10. That's good because I'm struggling at level 8. Like, that's twice now I've died at level 8. Some more health would be good show. And uh, maybe another attack with Valeria. You and a plus one are invited to my 4th of July BBQ tomorrow. Oh, do I get to pick? Jonah really wants to meet you. If he doesn't mind if you're dating someone else, no big deal. Are you going to invite anyone? Yeah, I'm going to bring Valeria. Tell him to bring something. Haha, <laughs> see you tomorrow. Oh, God. I wonder will she say yes. Mind meeting me again? Absolutely, that sounds great. I'll explain some things. Sure. You do have some explaining to do. Here's a hint for where to find me. Thanks. Is that the park? Let's see the park. Uh, how do I look? I'll take, I'll, oh, I'll, I'll try on the, no, I'll let the hair breathe and I'll put on the, she likes this. Yeah, she likes the old bomber jacket. I never put it, no, I'm going back in, I'm going to fix the sign. I'm sick of forgetting to put the signs on. I think I enjoyed it before I got mad into Hades beforehand. Hades is so fucking good. Oh, do you know what, actually, I was put off by Hades uh, because it's isometric and I don't like isometric, but it's actually not a bother in this. Like, it's actually not impacting me whatsoever. I'm like, if Hades goes, Hades on Game Pass. I've only heard really good things about it. Um, so yeah, I'll keep it, keep it in mind. If I like this, will I like Hades? I assume I will. Uh, vodka. Right, so we're full of gifts now. We have lots of gifts. Uh, 
no we don't we've nice, nice lots of fancy gifts uh, right Zines, 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 Zines. Throw a fireball, puts monsters to sleep. Or 20 experiments you can do at home. Oh, throws a mind trap. Okay, I'm going to go with the, the sleepy one. Hades is, yeah, it's a lot like this game. Right, that's good, because this is fucking whopper. Larry is sitting on the park bench, glaring at the nearby ducks. Her expression softens as she sees yours hey. truly. Hey. After how things ended. Yeah, use some explaining to do. What's up with that guy? Um. You seemed angry. Not at you. I can explain, but loud quacking uh. interrupts her. Shut up, ducks! Can you believe that noise? Fucking ducks! Probably not one of those people that feeds ducks at the park. I don't mind ducks, but I'm trying to smash. So good. I hate that beady little eyes. And don't get me started on those snapping bills. A friend of mine lost a finger to a duck. A fucking duck? Can ducks, can, ducks, can ducks do that? Can ducks take your finger off? I know swans can be bastards, but ducks? Would a swan even reap Like, a swan might break your finger. But could a swan even... I'm sure if he tried hard enough, he'd reef it off. But it's not like a fucking tiger or something. Like, surely a swan would have somewhat a difficult time breaking your finger off, let alone a duck. <laughs> Gone. Just like that. Is that true? Is it? <sighs> no. <laughs> um... Promise not to laugh? It didn't happen to a friend. It was me. Showing you a faint scar on her index finger. Oh, I could kiss it better. Mm. Oh, she loves that. She loves that. She shivers. And it, oh, God. All right. She pulls her hand back and smiles shakily. <laughs> You're uh, good at that. Ten of loud cry. Shut the fuck up, boys. Swans will fucking rape you around. Yeah, they, they yeah, absolutely rape you around. They, I can't believe you did that in front of the ducks. Oh, <coughs> excuse me. I can't believe you did that in front of the ducks. <coughs> Hello, Lou. Welcome back. Hope you're having a good time wherever you're at. Whatever will they think? Right. Whatever will they think? Would you like to offer a gift? Yes. Right, boys. I'll be feeling. Bourbon, vodka, or a cupcake. Uh, high quality. See, I, this is Isaac written all over it. All right. And the vodka. Surprisingly smooth for being well made. I'll go with the cupcake. She seems sweet. Just play it safe. Nice. Oh shit, that was a waste of a gift. I'm a dope. I'd already maxed out the relationship. But either way, I'm out now, so we'll head off in a minute. Oh, look, that's fine. Thanks for dropping in. We're just putting the graft in with this woman here. Next time we'll go on a date without the risk of duck. Okay, what do we get? Attacks do critical. Oh, sweet. That's actually really good. Huh? But we were talking about something actually important before. Right, I remember. I was going to awkwardly explain Jake. Yeah, I'm listening. <laughs> Thanks for open my procrastination. All duck, no fuck. Sag. What Sag, boys? I, that's the, there's a few Sag has been thrown in. Am I missing a fucking basic emote like that I need to add to the channel? Let me know. Don't like people not having what they want. Procrastination. Oh. So that guy who keeps showing up, yeah, the Grub Lord. His name is Jake. I dated him for a couple um. of years. And I dated his sister as well at the same time. I mean, they both knew. Is the game good? This game is unbelievable. Yeah, I'm actually having so much fun. Uh, people are so bitchy in it. All the lads I was graphing at the start have let me down. She's kind of my one shining beacon now. Gone full force with Larry because she's also a whopper weapon in the dungeon. I really like her moves. It. Add it, yes, Chris. We'll talk after the stream if they help me do that because I, I assume it's um, better TTV. But look, we'll, we'll, we'll have a look. And I date assist, they both knew. Uh, how did that work? Like any other relationship, I knew more talking and negotiating the mistakes. We were happy for a while. I was young and in love, and I thought we'd be together forever. Jake and Jessica and me, three artists against the world. We were everything to each other. We had the same goals, believed in the same things. And then greed and pride and ambition got in the way, as they usually do. Jessica wanted more, more recognition, more adventure, more everything. I wanted things to stay as they were, which was foolish. Nothing ever stays the same. Another lesson to be learned here, boys. I moved to Verona Beach looking for a fresh start and Jake followed me. I know you haven't had the best impression of him, but he's a good person, really. He's in love with you, absolute creep. Follows you all the way here, like, maybe a little. We were together for a long time, is that so strange? <sighs> but I think I've always loved Jessica a little more. That's terrible, isn't it? Uh, it's probably a franker's job, I'll, I'll fiddle with it. Uh, yeah, no, that doesn't happen, that shouldn't happen. Yeah, it's a bit fair, I'm working on it. As for Jake, I don't love him anymore. Not in that way. But we still have some business together, I suppose you could say. 
Look, I know Jake's been a bit of an idiot following us around and all. I'll talk to him about it. Get him to back off. For real this time. Anyway, enough about my drama. I got you a little gift. Oh, a beret. Enchanté. I saw it in the museum gift shop and thought of you. <laughs> Thanks. You don't have to wear it, but it'll look dashing if you do, I'm sure. But, you know, I'd love to show you my work sometime. You know, my paintings, if you wanted. Yeah, sure, sounds good. <laughs> then it's a date. I've had new inspiration lately. I think she's talking about me. Ciao. I look forward to seeing what you think next time. Smooth AF. As you leave, the afternoon light fades into evening. Who do you invite to Jesse's barbecue? Valeria, obviously. She accepts. She says she'll meet you there. Sick. Jake thinking he got a chance. <laughs> I know you have to pick up something to share. Cheesies. You worry it's not good enough. Will Jesse laugh at you? You buy it anyway. Even if nobody wants them, you can eat the whole bag yourself. You find Valeria waiting outside Jesse's house. Hey, stranger. Miss me? Nobody answers. Oh. Hey, it's my coolest cousin. Oh, look at the drip. I love this shirt. Looks really good. Everyone be friendly, okay? My cheeks feel warm. Oh, you brought cheesies. Samantha goes nuts for these. Yes, look at that. And who's this with you? Oh, my. Oh, you indeed. Thank you for letting me crash your little party. Very welcome. Want a little tour? I need to go in and prep burgers and shrooms. Yeah. Sure, I bought baklava too. Homemade. <sighs> Fancy dancy. Bring a date to the social gatherings. Look, they, they asked me to bring a plus one, all right? They do things differently over here. It's all mad progressive. It's it's lovely, but it's different. You know, we just got to roll with it. Oh, man, I can't wait. Thanks so much. In the meantime, Cody, meet Jonah. Here, go, talk. Wow. Wow. Wow, boys. Jesse puts the stranger towards with a wink um, and walks away. Hi, I'm Jonah. Shoot, you knew that already. And you're Cody. Can you become a sword, Jonah? No. Not... Not really. Already not as good as Valeria. Jesse said you fight monsters, is that right? So you're some kind of hero. It's... No big deal. <laughs> it's exactly what a hero would say, I'm on to you. Alright, slow your roll. I've been thinking about trying the dungeon for myself sometime. Jesse said you wield weapons down there. I know he said I can't become a sword, but I can sometimes be an axe. I don't do it often, though. I just decided to change shape like clenching a fist. Maybe I'll show you sometime. Anyway, I could definitely use the money from a gig, but you promise you won't hurt anyone? Like, not even animals? Only monsters. Ugh, what you mean? They're monsters. I don't really have a choice. I wish I wasn't hurting so bad for money. Here's my number. Maybe we can go together sometime. Don't worry, I'm not bringing you anywhere. If you want to go hang out, like as humans, I'm usually at the beach. Sounds good, yeah, we can be mates, but I kind of set up my dungeon a lot out, I'm sorry. The chest hair on this chunk. Yeah, he's a, he's a thick boy. And who's this cute friend of yours? Mm. Jonah. Wait, we've met. I know you. You're the one that always bought duck at the grocery store, right? Oh, no. This prick abruptly elbows his way into the conversation. Oh, hello. May I kiss your hand? Absolutely not. Fuck off. Now, my sweet, that is quite rude. Even if I know you're joking. No, Eric, I'm not joking. Uh... I'm not joking. You're right, Jonah. Kudos. Well, it's a free country. That's what this holiday is all about, right? A free country. It, like, you cannot come over and kiss my hand without consent, Eric. I'm sorry. Being a free country does not apply to that. Hmm. I'll freely decide to leave this party now. Good day. Yeah, don't let the door hit you on the way out. Give my regards to Jesse and Samantha. What after you fucking insult them? I'm getting so unnecessarily pissed off at this guy. That's put dampener on the whole fucking party. Are you okay? Eric really gets to you. Yeah, this game really this game gets me. I hate him. I do hate him. Where did your confidence go? Valeria gives you a little smile of sympathy. That guy gives me the creeps. Eric, Jesse, and I went to school together. He doesn't have a bad heart. I think he's just lonely. Well, John, you didn't hear what you're saying about Jesse. You probably fucking talking behind your back as well. That doesn't give him the right to be a jerk, but I wish he would just grow up. Eh. Uh, never understand. Uh, Maybe not. I have to hope so, though. It's had a lovely evening. Oh. Burgers and grilled portobellos. Walking the line between satisfaction and gluttony. Oh, I'm starving, boys. Gotta go make dinner shortly. 
At one point, the music is torn down and everyone quiets, watching the fireworks. As the sky explodes, you feel a wild, romantic energy surge through you. You have to kiss Valeria. <laughs> like Jonah's sound and all, but he's just plutonic. You share a tender moment together as the fireworks end. Someone turns the music back on. <laughs> Those were some explosions, all right. Now back to partying. I hope Jesse won't think I'm rude if I cut out now. I have work I want to do tonight. Mm -hmm. And celebrating a period as colonizers isn't really my jam. Oh, it's like that thing off TikTok. You fucking do. It was fun though. Nice meeting you, Jonah. Ciao. She gives you a light peck in the Bye. cheek on her way out. See ya. Left the fan for yourself. Tiredness soon overtakes me and you say goodnight to Jesse and Jonah and you shuffle home. Oh, we have some texts. Nice meeting at the barbecue. It'd be fun to talk more sometime. But I just remembered I'm out of town for the rest of the summer. Oh, well, that was that's kind of... That's a shame. You were sound. Yes, yeah, sorry. Maybe we connect again somehow, someday. If you ever come back to town in the fall, maybe I can show you some surfing spots on the island. What island? There's an island? Verona Island. The ferry is under repairs right now, though. Oh, well. I hope your summer in Verona Beach is the best. Thanks. See ya, buddy. I think we'll meet again somehow, sooner than we think. Cryptic. Jo <laughs> Joan. <laughs> These fucking emotes are on point. Uh, before you come over, I gotta clean. I mean, it won't be clean, clean. I'm not a nun. But this muffin from 2016 needs to be evicted. I will let you know when its smell is gone too. Oh my god. She's talking about what I think she's talking about. In the meantime, I found some cool art by the mall. Did you see this? Looks cool. Maybe we can check it out together sometime. All right. So how's the barbecue? Romantic? So romantic, right? You win. It was lovely. I had a great time. I knew it. Honestly, I consider my job here done. You've met some great folks, gone on some dates. I think I can back off and let you do your thing for the rest of the summer. Is that okay? No, Jesse, keep throwing mates at me. Oh, uh, okay, I can keep an eye open, no promises. I've got problems of my own, you know. Love you, cuz. Talk to you later. And because I'm such a loving cousin, I'm not going to ask him what his problems are, and if he needs help, I'm just going to not reply and close my phone. For whatever reason. Right, I think that's as good a time as any to kind of start packing things up. Oh, let's just... We'll, 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 we'll chill here for a second. We'll just chat it up. That game was mad like i can't i actually had so much fun playing it and i'm gonna miss it now before i kind of like I, i'm gonna be obviously not gonna play it while i'm off stream but yeah that was that was wild like i'm so pleasantly surprised with that game and um, thank you so much dill for recommending it uh i can't believe i didn't know about it like it's just it's, it's, it's gas crack it's a handy little easy game to be playing on stream which is nice like um so yeah that's gonna be that's gonna be us i think we're gonna wrap it up there's nobody seeming to be on for to throw an out raid somebody's way unless he's want to raid xqc or x2 shoes who i don't neither of which i think need the raid um but look listen i had a lovely time and as a thank you to you guys as a freebie as well i got i'll i'll, I'll get this right just 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 sit tight for one sec Now, just wait for the focus now. Look who it is. If it isn't the little sleepy missus who was beside me the whole stream. Working hard as anybody, aren't you? Sorry, now our next guests. Oh, thanks. <laughs> She's after been conked out on the bed. She's been conked the entire stream and she only woke up when I, sn when I sneezed. This is one of the turtles. Yeah, beware of dog. This is her. Uh, save everybody 5,000 points so you don't have to summon the dog. This is her. Hello, hello. Oh, she stinks. Her breath smells like fish. New chair. Ah, hey, thank you very much for the five bits. There is the threshold anyway, at least five for a chair. But yeah, this is the little baby, the real life teddy bear. It's full of licks, full of kisses. She's just been chilling the whole stream. She woke up when I sneezed, which was really, really funny, but I felt terrible. And she's been twitching and dreaming and yawning and having a great time. So I'm gonna just, I'll get her. She likes, look, there you go. See, there's the little teeth. <laughs> oh she's so good go on i'll put you back to sleep thanks for showing your set your face 
Now, folks. Oh, hang on. <laughs> my fucking headphones got stuck around their foot. I need to pull them off my head. Listen. I hope you guys had a great time. I had a lovely time. Thank you so much for tuning in and watching. I had a great time playing that game. That was really fun. I'm really looking forward to actually streaming again. This is going to motivate me now to maybe stream or off. No promises, because you know what I'm like. But I'm not going to play that game off stream. But I really want to play it. So that's a good uh, relationship between the two. And then it's going to make sure I stream more often so I can play that game. And then that'll keep us going until the 27th and we get some Stanley Parable on the go. Um, in the meantime, I hope you guys have a lovely weekend. Enjoy the rest of your Friday evening. Thank you so much for watching and I will catch you guys in the next one. See you then. Bye bye. Mind yourselves.